Uh, sounds You're now watching Vendo I gotta go fast, catch up, you been slow You win slow, smell the burnt rubber on my midsole Everything you do once, trust, we'll do it tenfold You're now watching Vendo What's up? Happy Not Friday! Can't we settle this over a pint? Ah, that was Shrek. Uh, hey guys. <laughs> Happy Saturday. Um, sorry, I, I couldn't be on yesterday. I had some real-life obligations. Um... March is going to kind of be, like, the worst week ever for Vindo Live. <laughs> I feel like almost all of it's going to be off schedule. Uh, next week, I'm at Sonic Symphony in Portland. So if you're going to be in Portland at the Sonic Symphony, come say hi. Uh, yeah. Uh, <coughs> anyway. Um, so I don't know what uh, the stream's going to look like next week. There might just not be one entirely. I'm not sure. Um, that that is TBD, but it uh, almost certainly won't be on Friday, and uh, just letting you guys know. But we are going into the month of Knuckles, ladies and gentlemen. It's it's almost it's almost time for Knuckles to have some limelight. So we're we're gonna be pulling out all the Knuckles stops for the month of April. I hope you're excited for that. Drunk stream, asked Kimberly. No, I'm just having a beer for now. I mean, a root beer for now. <laughs> I don't know. Does YouTube get you in trouble for drinking? I don't remember. Uh, it doesn't matter. What are they going to do? Demonetize a stream that... Uh, this doesn't matter. Uh, Starkiller, hey! Lucky Tales Game Room, hello. Uh, Lilac and Lola, hey, uh, guys, get the burp counter ready. Alexia Frizzle, because I also just inhaled KFC before this. <laughs> I had done with work, I was like, I have to go stream, but I need to eat some food. So I just vacuum cleaned a KFC chicken sandwich, and now we're here. Uh, Shadowstar13, hi! Hello! Uh, cracking my knuckles, hey guys, how are you? I'm terrific. I'm, I'm even better now that I'm here with all of you. So thank you for being here. Oh, thank you, seriously, all of you for being here. Um, uh, AJ Bennett, I think I already said hi, but if I didn't, hello. Uh, Lindsay and Jake, Kangaroo Mouse, hello. Jer Bear Show, what good Vindo, I love your channel. Thank you very much, I appreciate that. Uh, what's good? That's a good question. <sighs> Shadow the Hedgehog, the video game from 2005, which we're about to play tonight. That's good, right? I think. Um, like Tales Game Room. Hi, Ovindo. Hello. Lilac and Lola. Hello. 
Crossmare girl. H Harley. I'm 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 committing to this. I'm only gonna car call you Harley from now on, or else I'm just gonna read your super long username <laughs> every time. We're just gonna do Harley. We're just gonna do Harley. But hello, Harley. Thank you for being here. Uh, Alexia Frizzle says what? I don't know what that's in reference to. Is that in reference to Sonic Symphony? Yes. I don't know. Maybe. Anyway. Uh, well, maybe it can be settled with an Opie treat. Oh. Can't we settle this over a hashtag treats for Opie? Hashtag need the crunch. Hashtag need more Opie. Shadowstar, thank you so much. Appreciate you. Um, yeah. Jerry Bear Show. There's a shadow. Thank you for being here. Um, yeah. Let's give Opie a treat real quick. And then, uh, I guess before I do any of that, I'm just gonna press some buttons real quick. Ba 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 ba, ba 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 ba, ba 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 ba, ba 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 ba. Okay, cool. Uh, we might have some special guests coming by the show tonight, guys. Um, just just want to throw out that good juju. We might have some so guests, special guests. Ha ha. Some special guests. Hey, there it is. I was I was about to say this did not. Trigger for some reason, but there it is. I was it just wanted me to think about talking about it um, Oh, I meant to switch this out since we're going into the month of knuckles We're putting the first appearance of knuckles. He's not even on the cover We're just gonna put that right there. That's our book of the week here. All right, Obi boy. I heard you screaming Come here. Why do you do this? Why is and somebody tell my cat that he's scooping? Opie, that's not how you get a treat. You just come, you come over here. Motion brush you to get the cat to the darling. Come here. Thank you. Hello. And then you let me pick you up. And then you say hello to the people of the internet. But you have to especially say hello to Shadow Star Thirteen. That was pretty good. That was a pretty good hello. Look at that, Opie, 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 the boy, Opie, it's the fluffy boy, ah, uh, ah, uh. come on, keep him coming, hey, it's the boy, <laughs> okay, ah, uh, he's so cute, he is cute, I've got a cute cat, guys, I, I, I think I might have the best cat, and I know that everyone says that about their cat, but I literally think my cat might be the best cat, melting from the cuteness, does Opie ever do air crunchies? <laughs> Like, purr and do ASMR crunching sounds with nothing in his mouth? That'd be insane if he was just, like, making crunch sounds without anything in his mouth. <laughs> That'd be really, really funny. Okay, give us a crunch, Opie. Ooh. Visceral. Very visceral. You left something in my hand, man. I don't know if it's drool or... <laughs> If it's cat treat. Thank you. Yeah, I think you got it. Good work. Look at this guy. My cat Tuna does air crunchies all the time. Do, does Tuna make the crunch sound when they do it? Opie does like... He does like little meows that aren't meows. He doesn't even like make a noise. He'll just be like... <sighs> Sometimes he does that. Anyway... Opa boy, opa dude, opa guy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you one. Oh, okay, maybe I won't. <laughs> know your limits, Master Wayne. It's so hard because you're so cute. I just want to kiss you all the time. You got, you got kisses anyway. Ha <laughs> ha! I won. Was there consent though? <laughs> ouch! Ouch! There wasn't consent. <laughs> okay, goodbye, OP. <laughs> I asked for consent for the kiss, and then he bit my hand. And that's uh, that goes to show you ask consent before. Uh, always, even when it comes to your cat, guys. Okay, guys. <laughs> Let's play some video games. Uh, switch it over here. What's the button? What, what's the... Oh, my God. He's mad now. He's like, I want more treats. I got... Okay, I take back everything nice I said about my cat, guys. He's mean. All right, here we go. <laughs> Give 
Kisses denied. It was, yeah, that's, I mean, all I want to do is kiss his forehead. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. <sighs> Neglected brushing habits, teeth hurt. Hey guys, brush and floss. It's important. AJ, I hope your teeth feel better. Better? Better? Yes, hello? Is this Vinny? Uh, yeah, hi, it's me. Vinny? How are you, Ultimate Spider Plush? I spent time with cats today. Oh, did you, like, uh... Did you volunteer at a shelter or something? Or were you, uh, with, with you or a loved one's cats? Time to watch this iconic intro once again. Oh, yes. I can't bring myself to skip it. I like it too much to skip it. Hedgehogs are like onions. <laughs> like a Tales Game Room, you just got it on accident. I saw what you were thinking about typing, and I gave it to you. I don't know what else you want from me. <laughs> Good song, though. I agree. This is the ultimate song. Uh, I'm great. It's been a great weekend. In all caps. Dude, I'm glad. I keep feeling like... He, I don't know. There's like a phantom... He didn't... Uh, he didn't draw blood. But I keep feeling like he did. And I'm like, oh man, I don't want to bleed on my... On my controller. <laughs> now he's trying to break the walls down. I created a monster just because I wanted to kiss my cat on the forehead. Temperamental, man. Temperamental cat. Sometimes he's like, dude, I love it when you do that. And then sometimes he's like, I'll oh, destroy you. How did you bring yourself to skip this song anyway? Yeah, that's a great question, Simply Sweet. You can't. It's too good of a song. Hey, you better stop that, sir! That's what I thought. And Vinny's live. The weekend somehow got better. Hey, thank you. Appreciate that. Uh, What was I seeing here? Drunk Vinny is Shrek confirmed? No, I just, uh... That's just one of my favorite things to say when I have a pint glass. Can't we sell this over a pint? No? Alright then! I don't even think that's the whole line, but, you know, whatever. Um... There was a trivia night at my... This... Oh, hold on. There was a, a trivia night at this cat place that I visit and do kitty therapy. Oh, that's so cute! <laughs> oh... I, I hope that was fun. Um, it's funny how I watch this after watching people at a rodeo. Is there some... Iron oh, you know what? It's probably... It's probably because you noticed my hat. Which I've been wearing the whole time. It's not Knuckles Month yet. We can't wear the hat. Okay, here we go. Quest? I'm already on a quest. A quest to play Shadow the Hedgehog! My last copy kept crashing after the first stage for some reason. Of this game? Uh, this reminds me that I finally got an actual working copy of this game. Aha! Of this game! Harley, I hope you have fun with the game. Since I don't have my cats anymore, I go there and play with cats. Oh, that's so sweet. I hope you have a good time. Yeah, Harley, what uh, what console did you get this on? Uh, I have played uh, both the. Wow, get that burp counter going, guys. It's 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 high. This might be one of my highest burp count streams ever. Um, I played this obviously on GameCube. I've had this since launch. Um, and my buddy had it on the original Xbox, so I played it on his Xbox over there a lot. Oh, it's because of a bull whose name was Shadow. I see. Burp count three? Question mark. Definitely higher than that, Crack My Knuckles. I think I did three in a row just then. <laughs> oh, what's going on here? Who is this? What's happening? Hello? Is that Black Doom from Sonata oh Gen? My. Oh my god. 
Black Doom is is guys, ladies and gentlemen, Black Doom is on the show with me. Welcome to the show, Black Doom. Hey, how's it going? You know I'm Shadow. I'm doing terrific. I can't wait for you to do that voice for the whole stream. Yeah, that's me. This is my voice. <laughs> Black Doom, I understand you recently uh you recently had your final Twitch stream. How'd that go? Like it or not, I have yeah. Let me tell you. I wish the connection on the Black Comet was better. But, yeah. Uh, it worked out overall, and uh, I'm happy to say that my spawn will soon hatch. It will take over the planet of Norexia 8. Well, better them than me, am I right? <laughs> <laughs> you always know just what to say. I, I try. Hey, who does your internet up there on the comet? Michael Douglas. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Yeah, he's. He... <laughs> I've been... Hold on, is Michael Douglas also a, like emitting Wi-Fi? <laughs> like, are you connected to Michael Douglas, or did he just set up the connection? Oh, he just he just set it up. I mean, okay, <laughs> okay. He stopped by. And he, uh, you know, he set it up. And let me say, it's one of those Wi-Fi's that has the points throughout the common. So wherever you are, you get a good connection. Oh, that's However, that's good. However, when we're traveling outside of certain solar systems, the connection just completely dies. Well, uh, oh, I'm glad you've got decent enough connection to be here today, Black Doom. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Zorexia has a pretty good connection, and I'm not just talking about the Wi-Fi. Also, the <laughs> hey, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh, Doom, you're always joking. <laughs> always Josh in this one. Uh, so, Black Doom, what what uh, what's the whole uh, when you turn into a little eyeball man? Yeah. Is are you? Is is there two of you? Like, does it detach from you? How does it work? Very much so. It's basically like a drone it's on my forehead, and I can send it out and see whatever it sees. Oh, how does it talk or hear? Is that just telepathy or? Yeah, I mean, I don't even have a mouth, so. Oh, you know what? That's fair. I guess I didn't think of that. But you kind of got a bunch of folds, though, right? You like yeah, get the folds like, like kind of like double. They're like gills. No. Okay. Yeah. Sure. But I, I have a very easy way to explain how this works. If you've ever seen Toy Story three, when Mrs. Potato Head loses her eye. That's basically oh, yeah, yeah. what's happening with you. Uh-huh. Wow. That actually yeah. really cleared it up. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> basically, that's it. Well, I'm glad that I could have the scoop with uh, with someone who's who's going to be so, uh, so popular coming into this next year. Uh, because not only are you starring in the game Sonato Generations, but yeah, you are... Right. Uh, are you confirmed for Sonic Movie 3 yet? Or can you talk about that? Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Okay. Ultimate Spider Plush, thank you for 20 Mexican pesos. Play the dark mission? Smiley face? Oh no! I was already gonna do the regular mission! Alright, well let's see how many gun soldiers I have to kill. Most of them? Alright. <laughs> yes, kill the gun soldier. I guess, you know, it's only right. Black Doom's with me that I should probably just... Do the dark mission. All right, well, let's just go back to the beginning then, just so I make sure I don't miss anybody. Yeah, yabba dabba do it. <laughs> yabba dabba do it. As, as you always say, famously, as you always say, yabba dabba do fair, it. To be fair, I did come to Earth 50 years ago. Yeah, that's true. You, Your understanding of Earth culture is the Flintstones' original run. Yeah, it was really good. <laughs> I'm so glad. <laughs> What's your favorite episode of the Flintstones? I would have to say my favorite episode is the swimming pool, where Barney and Fred share the property of a swimming pool. Uh, voice is going a bit there. Um, where Barney and Fred are building a swimming pool, but Fred makes Barney do all the work. It feels like how I treated Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I gotta go. 
But I know this good guy named Dizzy Dennis. He'll take over for me. He's a great guy. Well, wait, Black Doom, I, I'm, I'm just, I'm about to finish your mission. All right, finish the mission and then I'll go. Wow, it was that easy to make you stay, huh? Your content. <laughs> yep, wow. I wonder, I wonder how long we can get Black Doom to stay. <laughs> I don't like it that much. <laughs> I wonder how long we can, we can really get Black Doom here. Hmm. I actually apparently did a great job of killing all the soldiers because um, we were. Yeah, yeah. I don't think I had to kill one. I think I got them all. Genocide is pretty great. Let's see. What are the questions we got for Black Doom, guys? Any any questions yeah. here in the? Uh, Ask now, or forever hold your peace. Yeah. Hey, um, Black Doom. Yeah. How did you? Uh, how did you meet Michael Douglas? Oh, really funny story. You're never gonna believe this, right? Okay. So, Michael Douglas was actually abducted by aliens way back. No when way. Was, yeah, but not the Black Arms. We don't do that. Oh, you abducted don't? No, 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 no. We don't. Wh anyway, what? What do you have against abducting people? I mean, that's basically kidnapping is abduct. Okay, but are you really above kidnapping? Yes. You tried to assassinate the president, am I wrong? Listen, I may be an evil alien dictator, but I'm not a monster. Well, at least you have somewhere where you draw the line, you know. I guess I can Listen, respect that. You can't be a leader if you don't know where to draw a line in the sand. Sure. Anyway. Michael Douglas was abducted by aliens. Yeah. We were just passing through. It's a small planet. You may have heard of it called Pluto. It's no longer a planet. No, that's no longer a planet. I was going to break that news yes. to you. Yeah. No, no, trust me. Imagine my face when I found out after conquering it. Yeah. But, well, did anyone live on Pluto, or...? Plutonians lived there, of course they did. Plutonians? Yes, they look like dogs. Like the Disney character Pluto? 100%. Wow. Just, you know, they have like, you know, slightly different noses and stuff, but basically, yeah, like they're Pluto. Alright. Uh, yeah, so the Plutonians actually abducted Michael Douglas and took them to Pluto while I was conquering it. And I noticed who he was, and I said, are you not Michael Douglas? And he said, oh, or yes, I am. I always did a Michael Douglas voice, which would have been very out of character for me. Uh, Are you um, sure? I heard you were really good at impressions. No, no, it's okay. Alright. Um, well uh, uh, oh, wait, you're done. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, oh, oh alright. See you later, Black Doom. Anybody who gets in my well, way ladies and gentlemen, enemy. that was Black Doom. Oh, man, if only we could have learned what blood type Black Doom was. Oh, well. Some things are better left unknown. Hey, Vinny. Hi, Dennis. How are you doing? My throat's coarse for some reason, but I'm good. Oh, that's really weird. Yeah, right? <laughs> uh, man, hey, Ultimate Spider Plush, thanks for asking me to do the worst level <laughs> in this game. <laughs> well, which is the worst level? I, do, I don't like this as a second level, this uh, little... The Black it's not Mad Matrix, is it? Major uh, yeah. Right? Every city is reporting no, it's the damage and digital circuit. Among them, yeah, I think that's it. Man, we are committed to the bit, though, man. <laughs> it's so <Downtown> stupid. <laughs> <laughs> I, I love that I, I can just like say something stupid that you could have easily just been like, no, I'm not doing that, and then you just play along. <laughs> that's my favorite part about you, Dave. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I, I also love how Michael Douglas came up because I had to think of a name and I couldn't think of a name. <laughs> you got Michael Douglas? <laughs> Who did your Wi Fi? And you hear uh, it, uh, Michael Douglas. <laughs> and then I almost did a Michael Douglas voice, but I realized I couldn't do that if I was doing the Black Doom voice. <laughs> How's Shadow treating you? So far, so good. Hey, that. That blue hedgehog again, of all places. I found you, handsome. Handsome? I think you're the handsome one around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Ha! Huh. I'm not even good enough to be your fake. 
I'll make you love yourself. <laughs> A very different take. <laughs> Turned very wholesome. And somebody in stream asked, or in chat asked, did I stop streaming? I'm on hiatus because my son's going to be born very soon. So, yeah. It's true. And you're naming your son Black Doom. Yeah, of course. That, that won't be problematic at all. Yeah, in God. Japan, what could possibly go wrong? Yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, but my son is going to be, or the due date rather, is um, April second. Uh, but we're in that period where he literally could be born any time now. Yep. So. Yes, um, indeed. Just waiting it out. I'm so excited for you. I'm excited too. I will. I do will say I do miss streaming though. But, uh, what is this? I miss watching you. I feel weightless. I miss uh, like... stupid jokes where I would laugh at the like songs getting cut off and saying I'm gay. <laughs> 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 well, I'm happy that you could uh, hop on this one though. I'm so happy. Oh, fun. Yeah, uh, my wife today was like, I want to just take a day home and relax. I'm like, sure. And then uh, Vinny, I asked Vinny, I'm like, about the streams and stuff. And then, oh, I, I said to Dizzy Wife, I'm like, uh, Vinny's streaming today. Do you mind? She's like, please go. I, I don't want to do anything today. I'm like, all right, cool. Heck yeah. So I spent I spend the morning with her, and now I'm here. I'm here. Um, should we help? Who should we Who should we help here, Dennis? Um, well, Black Doom left. So I say we help Rouge. Okay. He's also got that interesting pink outfit. In this, uh, in this yeah, it is. It is kind of interesting, isn't it? They were yeah, like, there was a time. Yeah, let's experiment. The Sonic Heroes you... model wasn't gonna work. I don't. I don't know. She's, well, no, they she's actually with like a different model, right? Like yeah, it's they the were gonna same... make her. They were gonna make her a fashionista and give her different outfits in each game. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Good for them. Designing outfits and toys. Just put her in the old one, but make it slightly different. Did you see that uh, skateboard art they have of Rouge now? No. Um, it takes like the official art, but they like, I guess they were ashamed of the cleavage or something, because they like took the heart on her outfit and like. Stretched it, pulled pulled it up and stretched it down. Like it's weird. So like it's like this bizarre. De it's this deformed version of the outfit. But it is what it is. Um, yeah. Um, also, uh, me coming to the stream is also like I don't know how many of these I can still come to. So yeah. Let's get them in while we can. Well, once again, we're happy to have you. Thank you for being here. Thanks for playing along as Black Doom for way too long. Yeah, that that is not a voice you want to get sucked, suckered into a bit with. You know? <laughs> I'm taking a cough drop right now. <laughs> I'm not even going with. This is the cost of being my friend: is being peer pressured into doing stupid bits for way too long. I guess. Man, I can't believe these ivermectin worms are about to get us. Also, I like how Black Doom is quite the jokester. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was he's a little lewd today, that Black Doom. You gotta have a sense of humor. If you're gonna be conquering planets and using, uh, using the inhabitants of worlds to feed your babies or whatever. Yeah. Oh, he says like in shadow. He says like we're we're saving the humans from themselves. What are you doing? <laughs> Me? Well, no, no, not you, Mister. Oh, Dean. like yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I mean, saving the humans, you're gonna devour them. I'm not sure where the. Well, because right. they they were gonna do it to themselves. So he's cool. giving them a purpose. Is his head cannon, I guess. All right, <laughs> I don't I'll know. take it. We should have asked um, him when we had the chance. I don't love you. I like. <laughs> oh, you're done. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seeing this has. Oh my god. Oh. Kid. 
Kid says, hi guys, sorry I'm late. Also feeding babies. I'm assuming this has something to do with Dennis' son. Yes, I'm harvesting humans to feed my son. <laughs> to feed your son. <laughs> what a dad. Yeah, I, I love him. It's funny though, I can't imagine what he looks like. Because obviously I haven't seen him yet or anything. I can't, like, put a picture in my head. So, maybe he'll look like Michael Douglas? Maybe he won't. I hope so. I hope he like, comes out. Grown. Yeah, like, I hope, <laughs> like, his face is just fully developed. <laughs> He, he hits you with a goo goo gaga. <laughs> I was an Ant Man 3, Quantum Mania. <laughs> Remember all the ants? <laughs> Dad, it's nice to meet you. Do you remember ants? <laughs> not, Ant like, not like ants, like, like the creatures, the movie ants, the Woody Allen film. <laughs> I do actually. I remember I got in trouble because. At one point, Woody Allen's aunt is on like a shoe or something, or in bubblegum, and he mm. gets picked up with the shoe, and he sees a, a penny of Abraham Lincoln, and he goes, "Who the hell is that?" And I said that I repeated that joke to my dad, and he got really upset. He's like, "You don't say that that word." That's, wow. That's a, that's, a, that's a curse word. So that's my memory of a yeah, Kangaroo Jack ruined my 11th birthday, and and aunt and, and, and not aunt, uh, aunt's <laughs> got me in trouble. Aunt, 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 aunt man. Um, <laughs> Yeah, when, when I saw no stream yesterday, I'm like, but I'm around! <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I always get chaos control in this area, and it's the most useless thing in the world. That also happens in um, Skyfleet. Yeah. No, not Skyfleet, Sky Troops, I'm sorry. Uh, see, I, I, I get mixed up on them because there's Air Fleet and Sky Troops, and those are the same exact names. Um, just said differently. Um, but uh, where you'll have the Chaos Control right before the Thunderstorm area, and you can't use it. It's like, whoa, thanks. Yep. At least with that one, though, you can jump, like, or you can hop on the Sorry, thing and then hop off this, and then Chaos Control. Sure it's but, like, you know they got the Z button right there. Why are they not using it? Oh. Like, because you have to, like, why can't you press the Z button to activate your power, you know? Use oh. it when you want to. You can use chaos control when you want to. You can chaos control behind. Hey, you guys, chaos sorry. Can... <laughs> I am late. Also, feeding babies. Oh, you already got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kit. Welcome in. Uh, will I get a timeout for saying shadow individually in chat? You know... Safe to su safe to assume that if you gotta ask, am I gonna get a timeout? Maybe just don't do it. That's one of the things they taught me at my job orientation as a teacher. To like, we love posting as a social media, but if you're thinking as you're posting this, could I get in trouble for this? Maybe don't post it. Yeah. <laughs> <So>. <laughs> even if it's not like, even if you won't be, if there's the smallest possibility, just don't post it. Yep. Uh, is it me or is Rouge's outfit different from her hero's one? It is different. They used her model, but they put her back in like the SA2 outfit. I, I think everybody else's models is just but it's copy not the and pasted. What's that? Not the SA, it's slightly different from the SA2 one. Yeah, it's slightly different. It's, you know, uh, uh, the black is pink now. Put her in the rider's outfit. Yeah. Oh, ooh. <laughs> Now there's an outfit right there. Um, I I had a I had a regular show me that <laughs> top hottest Sonic characters because <laughs> when people le learn that I'm a Sonic fan, they're always showing me weird Sonic things, and uh, I I assume you've seen that. So, someone here has to have seen this. Is it, are you talking about top top ten hottest Sonic females? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, and the line. <laughs> Roughly the size of a human mother is yeah. oh, yeah. is what has stuck with me. <laughs> oh, it's stuck with everybody. That's right. <laughs> and then you look up her real height. Was what are you on? by those humans? <laughs> but from where? What is her canonical height? Um, I don't remember. It's much smaller than, than the average mom. <laughs> the average human mother. <laughs> 
All right, what are we doing? <laughs> the first thing I got is, so is Vanilla abnormally tall for a Mobian, or is she just built that way? <laughs> oh, Tales of Power. Hey, remember for eight no. months, welcome to DiGiorno. Eight months of the best pizza. Hello, Vinny, Den Dizzy Dennis, and chat. Love you all. Want to say hi before I get to work? Hey, hello. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Eight months. We should all strive to be a community member like Tails. One of the best. Yeah. TTP. Hey, everybody. Tails. 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 If only Costco pizza could be delivered. You're right. No, they got to keep it under control, you know? Otherwise, hey, the chaos spam, that would spam the grumpy tails emote that I made. <laughs> That's one of the to... top secret discs! You want me to do the move? I can do a decent charming. I mean, only if you really feel like it's gonna eat away at you if you do not do the charming voice. Alright. <clears throat> Hey, Shadow, I gotta ask you something. Donkey Kong needs me to find them five top secret discs. But, like, what's a top secret disc? Is it poor? It's probably poor. I really hate to tell you this. Shadow, you were never supposed to see these. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you do, Charlie, don't look at the discs. Just pick them up. <laughs> All of the data on there was roughly the size of a human mother! Five tops! <laughs> Hottest Sonic female! That's so dumb. Gross. Yeah, it's a female. <laughs> Women or anything? <laughs> uh, Alright, what are we doing? Anyway, anyway, the answer's M. M? M? Oh, I forgot about M. Huh. I could be Agent one? M. Remember that? It's from Man Boy 2. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Get out of my house. Get out of my house. <laughs> um, oh. Hey, James D. Morris. Hey! <laughs> five months solid hogging time, baby! Yay! Yeah. Oh, hey, James. Welcome to delivery. Thank you so much. I gotta edit my, um... My, uh... Video where I look into the camera and give a big thumbs up and stuff, because my hair's much longer now. How long you Woo! Dude, Agent M, that really brought me back. Agent Munster Cheese? <laughs> Rip Michael, yeah, you right. Yeah, you right. Um, I brought up, I brought up X-Men when I mentioned to M earlier. Did you watch uh, X-Men? <laughs> no, I haven't watched it yet. Yeah, it's pretty good. I heard it was pretty good, and I was like, you know what? Maybe I'll watch it then. Um, I, I gotta, uh, as your friend, let me tell you. Pretty good. Pretty, um, pretty. I will say one thing that pretty, definitely. Pretty good. One thing that definitely has affected it is that there's a lot of. Wow, they just he, really extended this chaos control. Did you see he, that? That was ridiculous. <laughs> they were like, "Eh, we'll give it to you." <laughs> okay, go, sorry. Go ahead. That's okay. Um, uh, if there's one like. I, I, there's some small problems. Like I don't like how the mouths look in this because they use like, CG. And stuff. Right. Yeah. I was gonna um, say the animation seemed a little uh, hit or it, miss. It's actually very good. The... It's very good for most of it. There's, okay. There's occasional the lips, especially. I'm like, oh, it, it's like mimicking the old style, but it's not the old style. So it's like, right. Right. But um, one thing, and it's, I'm not really too upset about this, but it does because you know X Men's an allegory and stuff, so. Sure. Um, it, it does take a lot of that, but it takes a lot of modern sensibilities uh, for, for what we have with that and puts it in the 90s, which is like, well, 
I don't think they would have talked like that. You know? Like, I don't think they would have right. said it like that back then. But if that's my only gripe coming out of this, all right. You know? <laughs> Spidey uh, says, well, I hate the X-Men. I used to not like the X-Men either, and I don't know why. <laughs> but I think I was. I think that's. I think I learned the lesson. I think... <laughs> Dang mutants! Um, also, do, do you like Cyclops? Because Cyclops is actually my favorite X-Men. Yeah, no, Cyclops might be my favorite X-Men. Oh, then you're going to love the show, because this show basically just went, what if we just made Cyclops ridiculously cool? <laughs> Heck yeah. <laughs> By the way, came across a voice clip of Jet's voice in Freeriders, and um, not really a fan of that voice for Jet made me really appreciate... Uh, Jason and Dennis's voices for Jet well, says thank Kit. You. I mean, I always appreciate Jason Griffith and my friend Dizzy Dennis, but I also thank kind of like the weird, like Max Goof take. Yeah, I've described it as Max as well. Goof since 2010, so I know exactly. <laughs> yeah, you and I are on that same wavelength there. Yeah, I, like uh, what is that guy's name? Because he he was uh, was he Kovu in The Lion King too? Also. Wait, wait, are you talking about, about um, Max's voice actor or Jet's voice yes, actor? Yes, Max's voice actor. Uh, Max's voice actor, I gotta check. Uh, Jason Marsden. I, I thought it was Marsden was his last name, but I was like, he's not James. That's Cyclops. No. And he was, uh, yeah, he was in Lion King. He was, yeah, he was Kobu. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, no, and he was the uh, Kid Cuisine guy. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> How long are you going to grow your hair out to? It looks great so far. Thanks, Kimberly. I'm probably going to get it trimmed soon, but I'm going to probably keep it like this Adam Driver length. Uh, hey, I have a question. I've been meaning to ask you, and I'll see what I'm going to look it up. Staring at um, hey, Shadow! Shows... I was wondering if I could ask you something. <laughs> what, I, I sorry, gotta what? ask you a question, Shadow. Um, in Star Wars, uh, Rise of Skywalker, does Skywalker mm. die? I literally don't remember. <laughs> you, is that, like, your serious I, question you were gonna ask? I really me? forgot. I'm like, I know they kissed. <laughs> yes, he dies. Okay. <laughs> but he got, like, thrown down a hole, and then came out of the hole. Oh. Uh, His only <laughs> word is Ben Solo. Is ow. <laughs> hey, I've got, you look, you look right here. Ben Solo bobblehead. Uh, there he is. But what what kills him? Well, he got like super electrocuted by the Emperor, and like he was like, "Oh, Ray, oh." Well, because he like crawls out of, he gets thrown in the hole. Yeah, and he comes and then out like he somehow. he he pulls himself out of the hole, and then Ray was like, "Oh, I just I used all of the force to to stop the bad force." And then Kylo Ren's like, "Okay, I gotta, I gotta, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put my my hand on on your body, and and it's going to heal you. You're going to, you're going to be better." And so then she he, goes, he like, heals Ray. Yeah, he heals Ray. With like he uses like a little little force heal action. Yeah, and that then she Rey's did like, earlier in the cave. And then Ray's like, "Oh my God, it's come full circle." And then she kisses him because I think they were like, I think I think people want them to kiss. <laughs> and, and then they kissed. And and then he died. So it was just lightning? Spoilers for Star Wars Rise of Skywalker. But <laughs> I, I do not like that movie. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's fine. Yeah, it's uh, it is what it is. It, it's surprising that it is as good as it is, honestly, I think. Because, uh, like... They basically gave JJ. They like, re, they hired on JJ Abrams so late in the game, and we're like, you, you, we're not moving the release date, so you got a year to make a Star Wars movie. So I mean, like, for it to have come out any way, almost coherent, good for them, I guess. Uh, not what I really wanted, but it's, I don't know. It, JJ Abrams, he's kind of like. Uh, Zack Snyder in a way where he can make something look really cool, but it's not necessarily gonna be like uh, what I was looking for. I was very disappointed. Like I liked uh, 
I liked, um, what was the first one called? I'm sorry. Um, Force, Force Awakens. Awakens. Yeah. Um, I like, so I really like some parts of, um, Last Jedi. Um, yeah. And I did, just did not like much of anything in, in that one, the last one, Rise of Skywalker. Yeah, that's okay. Not being a hater, not being a hater. Yeah, no, yeah, that's fine. I don't, I don't, I don't mind. People can like what and dislike what they want. My my favorite though is when people are just like, I just don't get. How come Ray was able to 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 fight a guy with uh, with a lightsaber even though she never owned one before? That doesn't. It's a movie. <laughs> she, we didn't get to watch her do a training montage though. <laughs> so dumb. Who cares? Right. Shut right. up. And then we got and then we got our training montage. And I was a Skywalker with, with with Carrie Fisher not being there. So, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. You think that <laughs> you think after they killed off Luke, and then Carrie Fisher unfortunately passed away, they're like, oh my god, <laughs> what yes. do we do? <laughs> yes. Was Luke in Episode Nine? Yeah. He was a Force Ghost. Cause like, he comes on, he comes on the screen, and like Ray's like, I don't want to be a Jedi anymore. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna be a bad person because I'm related to a genocidal maniac. And then <laughs> she's like, I don't want this stupid thing anymore. And she throws her lightsaber, and then the Force Ghost Luke catches it, and is just like, Hey, remember in the last movie when all you nerds freaked out because I threw that lightsaber behind me? I, right. I picked it up. Lightsabers are sacred, Ray. So Even stupid. though he threw it. <laughs> so you can stupid. smell the course correction. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of dumb things in that movie. Still mm -hmm. have a good time with it though. Why do I become the Beatles? <laughs> I became the Beatles to you? Is that what the Beatles sound like? I still have a good time with it though. <laughs> what? I still had a good time with it though. <laughs> <laughs> arguing over Star Wars. <laughs> Ringo would have had a good time with it. <laughs> um, well, I'm going into this movie with peace and love. Peace and love. <laughs> there will be no more Star Wars. If you send in a treatment for Star Wars Episode 10, it's going to get tossed. Peace and love. What are peace they doing and Wars? love. Huh? What are they doing with Star Wars? <laughs> they don't know. <laughs> they're so at a at a loss right now because like they're like, man, that the last episode didn't like episodic title didn't do well. Mandalorian is now even receiving like meh kind of reviews. Um, and like they just yeah. The next, the next theatrical release, I think, is a Mandalorian and Grogu movie. Is what they're doing. Um, but yeah, they that. don't, they don't, yeah, they don't know what anyone wants because it, there's, it's a franchise that's been along. Oh, oh my God, oh God, I hate this. No. <laughs> Can I survive this? No. You're right. I recommend you for trying. <laughs> Kill box is just right there. Okay. Um, no, because they, 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 yeah, they just don't know what they want. They don't know what anybody wants. They're, they're, it's just, you know, everybody's Star Wars is different, and so like I'm kind of Star Wars out. Right now. It's and that's the other thing is that like they pushed it way too hard for too long, and didn't give anybody a break. Like by the, I I don't know what they were thinking releasing Solo so close together with. Last Jedi, because like I think that really kind of helped fatigue everybody. Right. Um, I used to love Star Wars, and now I'm just like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and like all all of the shows, that, with the exception of Andor, recently have just been like not good. Yeah, I did not. Like, so. I think you like it more than I did, but I did not like Ahsoka. Yeah, no. it was it was fine. There was things I liked, but it was mostly just like. A thing that happened, and then there was a couple characters that I was like, "Wow, they're in live action now." <laughs> yep. But for me, I think Ahsoka was the one where I'm just like, I don't like Star Wars that much anymore. You know, like, I'm like no. 
that was my yeah. final straw. I was like, I'm, I'm good. Well, I'm like, here's the, the thing about Ahsoka is that everyone's like, Dave Filoni, you gotta give full creative control to Dave Filoni. And it's just like, alright, but like, <laughs> he's not perfect either. No. I think what they should do... <laughs> <laughs> I think what they should do is a real suggestion, it's not a joke. I think what they should do is, uh, they need to do a Star Wars thing that has absolutely nothing to do with any of the content that's been made. Like, set a Star Wars movie, like, 2,000 years prior to Star Wars. Give us, give I mean, us some, some ancient that's what, Jedi uh, stuff. That's kind of what Jedi Knight Jedi. is, right? Well, that's what uh, uh, this new show, The Acolyte, is. It's taking place in the High Republic era, which is, I think, literally 2,000 years before. <laughs> oh, well, perfect. Yeah. So By the I'm way, so getting... surprise, I'm the showrunner for Star Wars now. <laughs> no, we've got <laughs> Kathleen Kennedy here, ladies and gentlemen. Hi, I'm <laughs> Kathleen Kennedy. Um, Say something I'm, controversial. Piss, I'm piss not, off some nerds. I'm not here <laughs> to talk about episodes uh, uh, seven through nine. <laughs> I, uh, I, I am here to talk about, however, how uh, we're going to do a Chewbacca yes. sequel to Star Wars. Um, Is it a sitcom? No, it's gonna be like a sh it's gonna be like a, a shorter, like maybe an hour long. And we were thinking about making like, listen, I know this sounds crazy because it's a galaxy far, far away, but I was thinking uh, we were gonna do like a like a holiday thing. So around Christmas, uh, expect to meet Special? Chewie and his family. I mean, I guess you could call it a special. Uh, we are going to be airing it on the Disney Channel first. Very progressive of you. Yeah, the uh, everyone's coming back. Uh, we got Harrison Ford coming back. Uh, wow! Is Carrie Fisher coming I saw him back? getting a pizza today. We're 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 getting a hologram of Carrie Fisher. It's gonna be in <laughs> oh, the movie. Oh, thank God! Yeah, it's gonna be respectful. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I, I've got I've got high hopes for this project. I think the fans are really gonna like it. Kathleen Kennedy is um, is Adam Driver coming back? Uh, Adam Driver is also going to be in the holiday special. Yes, he's. Uh, we're oh. going to be CGIing his face onto the body of a baby. So, uh, oh, baby, we'll good. Because he's, he's because now he's still playing he's... Ben. Yeah. Well, but now he is not. Adam Driver, he is Baby Driver. <laughs> now he's Baby Driver. That is, it, it's like nothing to do with the movie, to be clear, to be clear. But uh, he is called Baby Driver in the title of Good. Thank God. I just want to jump off of that. Did you know that the actor from Baby Driver, I don't know his name, the guy who played Baby. Yeah. Um, he's fluent in Japanese. Like, he was oh, on like, Japanese TV recently, and he's just like, yeah, I, I'm, uh, you know. Uh, I learned Japanese because of some of the TV shows I've done, and I can speak Japanese really well. And he just flew it, like, flew it. <laughs> Good for him. him. That's fun. Kathleen, do you know any Japanese? Um, yeah, I, I know how to say, uh, Arigato gozaimashita, and I know how to say, uh, Stars of Wars. <laughs> 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 It's very, it's very important. Hey, TT3, thank you for gifting the sub. Appreciate that. He's a good one. What did I say? <laughs> we love TTP over here. No, guys, this um, is not Jen. This is Kathleen Kennedy from yeah, Lucasfilm. I'm, I'm Kathleen Kennedy from Lucasfilms. Um, I, I guess I can answer some questions about some of the uh, controversies surrounding Star Wars, if I must, but I'd really rather talk about the uh, the Christmas movie that's coming up. And um, Are you open to ideas, Kathleen Kennedy? Uh, maybe. I mean, it's still in production, so, uh, I, I mean, I'm not going to pay you for any of them, but... Could we give Santa a lightsaber? Well, Santa's already a Wookiee. It would be cool if he also had a lightsaber. All right, thank you. You don't have to... I just want to see it. You know, it being in the production itself is more than enough for me. Well, um, guess what? If you visit uh, any, if you visit uh, the Disneyland Resort or Space Walt Disney Time. World, 
And you go to this Galaxy's Edge, so guess familiar. who's gonna be there as a walk around character? Santa? Santa, and he's he's got he's got lightsabers, he's got on like armor. Oh, yeah. he, he does he have his great. iconic crossbow? He does. He has Thank his God. iconic crossbow Die. with which he can shoot the naughty children. Oh, yeah. Bring it on. <laughs> it is I thought you were gonna say shoot the Nazis. Which I was hoping would cross into I mean, Indiana Jones. I mean, he also shoots the Nazis. Uh, the naughty, not the naughty Nazis. The Nazis are objectively naughty, so yes, we do. So they all get shot. They all get shot. It's a it's a wonder that the war lasted so long. How fast can you travel? Oh, Santa! I thought you said how fast can I travel? I was like, well, how oh, fast? Like, what's uh, your depends. What's your mile? <laughs> Dep depends on the freeway, right? Hey. <laughs> Put me on the Autobahn, we'll see what happens. Um, how fast can Santa travel? Uh, he he doesn't travel in like a speed that regular human people can comprehend. I had a, I had an extensive conversation with this about uh, about this with George Lucas over lunch, actually. Um, he actually like he sort of exists outside of time in a sense so he actually exists in all places simultaneously when he's delivering presents like the lake house with keanu reeves sure <laughs> i never saw that Kathy Kennedy, you're a big movie person you should see every movie i'm busy seeing my own movies <laughs> What? Whoa, Nightshade, four ninety nine. Vinny, why is Kennedy here? We want Jen, an actual Chaos person with control. real, talented, and original ideas. Hey, 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 hey! I did my best. <laughs> Kathleen Kennedy, uh, you were also responsible for the good parts of Disney Star Wars that people like and tend to ignore the fact that you were also heavily involved in, right? Yeah, everybody, everybody forgets about how good Solo was, or or how good what? some of Rogue One was. You're digging your own grave here, Kathleen. <laughs> Kathleen Kennedy, I have another question. I don't know what you're talking about. Solo is a good movie. <laughs> yeah, it was all right. Yeah, I have another question for you, please. Oh, please. sure, 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 sure. Yes, uh, you in the um, uh, the little fella. <laughs> it's a Garfield shirt. Um, but um. Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Um, but um. <laughs> Uh, Kathleen, I, uh... have you ever drawn a little Garfield? <laughs> <laughs> I, I could. I mean, I have this projection uh, right here. I can draw a little Garfield if that's if that's this gentleman's question. No, my, okay. my question is, um, I know we had the, the the droids cartoon and everything, but I was thinking we could get a C three PO solo movie, but it would just be about him running a little a little Italian restaurant. You know, well, I, I I think that we could we all want to see that side of C three PO. I'm sorry. Are you are you in the writing department? Because like I, we are making a movie called C3PO Solo, and it's exactly the same as Solo, only it's C3PO is the main character. And Wait, at the is end, it the same and he story? is Solo. Yeah, it's the same story, but at the end, he does in fact decide to open a little restaurant. An Italian restaurant? Yeah. Which is weird because we... Italians don't exist in a galaxy far, far away. Oh, call we, well, you've call got that. Dexter we Jetster. We thought it would be, you know, a little, a little fun and playful to just have yeah. it be an Italian restaurant with a spaghetti and all that stuff. With a spaghetti. <laughs> a spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> um, Kathleen, yeah. um, I know you know there's a lot to talk about with Star Wars and the other Lucasfilm properties, but can we talk about for a moment the hit? film strange magic the hit film strange magic Ugh. yeah can i can i be can i be honest with you what's up of course i was on a lot of drugs when i was involved in that project really and I, have, I have absolutely no memory of it whoa <laughs> yeah wow. you know every everybody's got their past i guess so it must be stressful being you know in your position it's so stressful, especially uh, all the yeah. hate that I get for every single Star Wars movie I attempt to make. It's, it's hey, did you know rough. that you're not George Lucas? I mean... Do you know you, you'll never create something as iconic as the original Star Wars? Uh, I mean, I feel like... Did you know like that I, you're responsible for like... all the pain I've ever had? Can I... Hey, I have something to say real quick. What's up? Uh, I, I was was a producer on some very notable beloved uh spielberg project. name one name one jurassic park 
Uh, doesn't Which one? count. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> the first one. Doesn't count. Yeah, Why Kathleen doesn't Kennedy is a fraud. Yeah, look, you're a listen. phony, Kathleen. No, no, look, look you're me up. You're a fraud, Kathleen <gasps> Kennedy! Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. No, I've finally been caught. It's true. I had nothing to do with Back to the Future. Or <laughs> of course you didn't. Uh, hello, hey, 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 everybody. Uh, hi, it's, Lucas. Five goes west. Yeah, wasn't there. Yeah, it's me. Captain it's me, George Lucas. Lucas. Oh, George hey, Lucas here. Uh, uh, hello. Uh, don't don't call me, babe, please. Um, uh, hello, everyone. I, I I wanted to come on to uh, Findle Live, which is a, a very popular YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. uh, I want I wanted to come on just to. Uh, uh, to announce that I, uh, the special editions of all of my films, as well as uh, Steven's films, mm -hmm. uh, my, my friend Steven Spielberg, I call him Steven because we're so close. Um, well, uh, special editions of all of our movies are coming out, and um, to appease to appease fans, we are digitally altering Kathleen Kennedy's name in the credits. Uh, yeah, it, it, I, it, I deserve it. No, uh, we're we're removing you from the credits. Oh no no no! Put me <laughs> get me in there. Because um, we, Listen, we've, we've, how, re we've realized why? that uh, uh, women, women don't watch <laughs> movies. Why, why, why would I, you I think do that's this? the message. Hey, hey, <laughs> hey. <laughs> why would you do this to the executive producer of We're Back a Dinosaur Story and The Flintstones? Huh? Right. Why would you do this to Kathleen Kennedy, were you actually attached to The Flintstones? I was the executive producer, baby. <laughs> she she, she was. Uh, she, she, she was. I, I, I can spare you the Google. Uh, but I was also but the after the special edition who comes out, Roger Rabbit, I've done damn good work in this. Af business. After after the special edition comes out, uh, all of that will be erased. So uh, we can <laughs> only remember her for the Star Wars sequels, which I am actually deleting from canon. I'm I'm coming back to Lucasfilm. I don't uh, think that's how it works. I'm I'm coming back to my my own film studio. I don't uh, <laughs> think that that's how that works. Rachel, thank you for six months on delivery. I just walked into it. You didn't. I, I don't know what you walked in on. I, I, sorry, you, you keep interrupting me. Uh, I, I know. I understand this is your show, but I'm, I'm a pretty big guest, so we better steer the focus back on me. Uh, this is why people don't like you, and we're glad that you've sold Star Wars. Excuse me. That, that's an opinion that only only you have. Okay. I don't know about that. Um, and that's why people don't like you or your or your movies. People don't like you either. George. I've I've heard people say that you're a stinky, smelly gym sock. I have heard people and I, say, and I haven't seen anything that would like refute butt, that. So, um, I haven't seen anything that would refute that you are a stinky, smelly gym sock. So, um, I'm coming back to my own company, and I'm making I'm making my own sequel trilogy, uh, to to appease the true fans of Star Wars. We're erasing the original sequels from the canon. This is true. Uh, you can quote me. Any any YouTuber can quote me right now, mm -hmm. um, and they will. Don't worry. <laughs> um, you 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 can quote me. Uh, I'm coming back to Star Wars. I'm going to erase uh, the the dark side of the Force, which is female. Okay, George. I think I need to call <laughs> your nurse. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I, I've, I'm confirmed as, as sexist now because I think that's what the fans want. Hi, uh, Steve? Yeah, Vinny, Vinny's not helping me. Yeah, Georgia, Georgia's, um, <laughs> I noticed that he's not in his phone right now. <laughs> no? Yeah, he's uh, who, who are you on the phone with? Who are you, who are you? I'm speaking, uh, to, um, I'm ordering a pizza. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's, that's fine. <laughs> anyway. What, yes. what kind of pizza is it? Is that, is that from Tony Sony's? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what kind of pizza do you want, George? Uh, anchovies. Anchovies. Okay. Yeah. And uh, bring, some, uh, put some anchovies on that pizza. Uh, that's not how you order a pizza. That sounds. That's. This sounds like you're lying to me. I'm not lying. I'm Kathleen, are you lying? No, I've store? never, I've never <laughs> lied in my whole life. <laughs> Have you? Well, there was the one time where I told everyone that, <laughs> uh, that Luke and Leia have, were always going to be siblings. Yeah, that was that was a pretty big lie. 
Yeah. I didn't I didn't have that figured out. Let's begin. I won't lie. Uh, but I did what about, about what about it. Greedo lie. shooting first? That was a lie, right? I feel like the game is maybe broken. What's happening here? Okay, hold on. Okay, never mind. We're we're fine. Uh oh! <laughs> um George or are you chatting? Since I have you both here. Yeah. Um yeah. What, since, know, Well hold on. I mean Okay. Do you have a yeah, question what, about what? Flintstones, young man? Um, it, it, no, but close. Um, I was thinking, you know, George is, is very prolific with, with sci-fi, and Kathleen, you are a, a god amongst producers. Um, so I yes. was wondering if maybe, you know, we could take that That's magic debatable. and... And <laughs> I think we could take that magic and maybe we, you know, like what we did with the Flintstones, we could maybe do it with the, uh, the Jetsons? That sounds great, actually. Um, yeah, I do, um, whatever I Kathleen do want... says, I say the opposite. <laughs> and and here's want, why. Uh, I do want George's, what, your ex-wife to be on the project? She's basically the only reason Star Wars was good. Okay, okay. <laughs> I, I, I feel, I, I sense a lot of hostility here. Uh, oh, really? Yeah. Hostility? I, I, think, I don't know why. I don't think why this would, is very Why would I, I be hostile? Why would I be hostile, George? Well, I, here, here's the thing. I, I signed over I signed over my company, uh, and I and I and I and I leave it in 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 your hands, which I thought were capable, and and you, you delivered uh, what I can only respond to as uh, a steaming pile of bantha fodder, uh, which is <laughs> which is what I call a dog poop. Well, I don't disagree with you there, and you know what? I'm blaming the mouse. You're blaming the mouse, huh? I I, I blame I'm you. I'm blaming the mouse. We, well, you're you're the one who I left it in charge. So, yeah, but, so if, if know, it's not your fault, then whose fault is it? The mouse. I don't think the mouse himself. I, what, what, what are, you, are you saying a mouse made those movies? No. Right, well, hold on. Uh, well, hold, wait, I'm, hold I'm on. Saying, I'm saying Kathleen. Big Disney. Big Disney got in the way Kathleen of me Kennedy, making are a you coherent me, trilogy. Are you telling me that you got ratatouille into making the sequel trilogy? Yeah, that's exactly a what that is. A little mouse. That's how, that's how Big Disney A little mouse operates. was pulling your hair. Yeah, if if you're not if you're not doing this the job, this all makes so much more sense. If you're not doing the job that Bob Iger wants you to be doing, he sends a little ratatouille after you. This this makes so much more sense. So, so yeah. you're telling me uh, a little mouse came over and pulled your hair, and and that's 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 how we got. Yeah, a, a little the, mouse. The three came, Star Wars films that we got. A little mouse came, pulled my hair, and I said, "What about a space casino?" A little okay, sure. a little mouse pulled my hair, and I said, "How about Palpatine comes back?" I, I don't know. I, I had no control over it. It was awful. So I was thinking for the Jetsons, you oh, know, yeah, yeah, maybe yeah. maybe we could get um, you know, it is just an idea. So you can you can you can you can shoot it down if you if you don't like it. I'm, I'm already I'm, I'm love gonna, it. Don't worry. I, I'm already on board. <laughs> but you know, uh, well, who do you think would be be a good a good uh, George? Because I was thinking Nicholas Holt or John Leguizamo. But, I'm a good uh, George. Nicholas Holt. Hmm. You're not a good George. I'm a great George. By the way, I called your nurse on you, so let's see what we can drag back home. Ask my, ask my dozens of fans all around the world. <laughs> I have fans. Tens of them. I said dozens, okay. <laughs> Same difference. Um... I could see I could see Nicholas Holt potentially being an acceptable George Jetson, but honestly, we need to what stop. What about Steve Holt? We need to stop Steve Holt. We need to stop <laughs> hiring British actors to play roles that are deeply American. But George Jetson, I I would say he he defy, like he goes beyond uh, culture. You know what I mean? Like he, he, yes, he but he's, is that an he's auto based, kill? He is what based on that? like 1950s and 60s American sitcoms. Which okay. is uh, the best but, era, I, I think. Um, but you know, you know, men men could speak a little more freely. Am I right, boys? All right, all right, George. Um, but um, yes, okay, you, you you know you know Rosie, right? The the the, the robot maid. Damn. That's the um, casting choice that I'm more concerned about. Like, yeah. do we hire Osimo? No, do we Rosie hire? O'Donnell. Do we hire Rosie it's O'Donnell in a Rosie in O'Donnell. a Tin Man suit? I- yeah. <laughs> I, I, you know, I, I've been, I've spent most of my life putting. I, Kathleen, you wouldn't know anything about this because uh, you, you were right up to it your whole way through this. Mm-hmm. Uh, I, I've spent my whole life putting little men and women into little tin cans. 
I've been, I've been shoving little men and women in, into into trash cans oh, and, and yeah, saying, right, 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 like like the like the gonk droid. Yes. Hello. Make 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 some little boop beep noises, please. They make the boop beep noises. Oh yeah. yeah. Those are recorded in the sound booth. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. You, did did you mic them for that? Of course. Yeah. Wow. That's, that's how, that's how it gets uh, George Kathleen, really I'll be right talent. back. You just just uh you know keep it civil, okay? I'll be back. I'll keep I don't it know civil. if I can yeah. do that, but you know what I guess. Keep it civil. George, is there anything that you Just like, like you created another galactic civil war, is that correct, Kevin? Yeah. You know You just can you were you, what, you're out of ideas, huh? Okay. First order. I, that kinda sounds a little bit like uh something something I created called the Empire. Okay. First order uh, sounds like the Empire? Well it sounds like in concept. Well, here's here's the thing, George. I base the first order on present day American Nazis, which is why they were very incompetent. Does that make sense? <laughs> yeah. Well, I you know when I see it in that light, uh, a little bit. Uh oh. Oh okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, any anyone in chat have any questions about the Star Wars? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Kathleen and I, uh, our, our time's limited. We can here. answer we're, we're, we're very anything. important people. But yeah, we will answer any question you ask. We'll answer any questions about Star Wars. Wow. MM Sweet said earlier, I can feel myself decaying. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, I, I, don't, I don't understand. Uh, I, do, I don't understand. Is, is, have, you, have, you, uh, is, have you experienced too much of Kathleen's Star Wars? <laughs> <laughs> Am I right, man? <laughs> oh, yeah. Every rumor you've ever heard from any random YouTube channel, it's true. Mm -hmm. uh, Nightshade says, Kennedy, why did you take on Star Wars if you hated it? Um, the money. Wow. Yeah. I, I you know, that, I, I, I was, I was charge. pretty. Listen, I was pretty sure. That it was going to make me a lot of money, whether it succeeded or failed. And you Oops. know what? I was right. Oops. Uh, the, real, the real, the real three three panda push. gamer asks, why does Anakin hate sand so much? Oh well, that's uh, that's actually that's based off of me. Um, I'm not a fan of of sand uh, myself. Uh, sand. <laughs> Is there anything more to that, George? Sand, uh... Oh, well, hold on. Do you know the Pokemon Sandaconda? Yes. Uh, that was my first Pokemon. Wow. And, and I, you and just I caught got him. into it, huh? <laughs> yeah, right. And I caught him. And... And I said, okay, let's go fight the Elite Four now. Uh-huh. And, uh... Well, Sandaconda, he, he failed me in, in immeasurable ways. I think that's... Uh, Probably on you, actually. Much, much like Kathleen Kennedy did after I after I left Star Wars. Wait, I, I I'm just still trying to fathom what uh, what, what, uh, what, what, what you were thinking, Kathleen. I, I'm sorry, the Force is feet. Well, hold on, mean? hold on. Super what are, what is, what is the Force says, what, "Will what Jar Jar force... Binks return and become the main character?" Funny you should ask that. Keep an eye out for uh, the next Star Wars holiday special. It's an Easter special <laughs> about Jar Jar Binks and his family hunting eggs. Oh boy, can't wait! Can't wait for that. Oh George, oh you, you, you make too many special editions. Oh George. Stop, stop making all these changes. Okay, here's what you wanted. Are you happy now? Oh, Jarder's, uh, Jarder's oh, that's, family that's Easter an, vacation. That's an interesting discrepancy. Kid the Amateur Art Doll says, Sandaconda didn't exist when that movie came out. Well, um, do you have any, um, do you have any explanation for that lie that you told? It's not a lie. I, I've, I've been playtesting for Game Freak for years. And, and every generation of Pokemon is actually 40 years in the making. Uh, wow. So, uh, I, I've been, I, 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 with my <clears throat> polls, um, my uncle works at Nintendo, and <laughs> with, my, <laughs> with with my polls, uh, I'm I'm able to to play these these uh, Pokemon games far in advance and and learn much much about the generations. They're they're constantly asking me questions like George. Uh, uh, what would this what would this character do if, if he was in your your Star Wars universe? 
And I say, well, uh, that's a that's a question for Kathleen Kennedy now, isn't it? Hmm. And they say, well, George, uh, you, you're such a wise guy. Can, can't you tell us a little more? The pieces are coming to and I say, uh, uh, sure. Uh, Santa Conda is my least favorite Pokemon. Hedgehog. And he died, and I'm his yeah. copy. Uh, the Unjolly Snowman. Oh, no, no, no. Android yeah, yeah. The Unjolly Android. Snowman asked, I got a question. Is C3PO slash R2D2 canon? Done. The fans must know. Funny you should ask that. Uh, keep an eye out for uh, our upcoming holiday special premiering on Disney Plus um, about Arbor Day, in which C3PO and R2D2. Oh, thank God. The after Star Wars having Arbor Day after special. having settled down together, uh, <laughs> they they discover the importance of trees to the environment. Oh great, yeah, because the the Ewoks on Endor didn't, didn't already teach I'll us this lesson. Wish you never created me. Oh, Real original, in, Kathy. They didn't in they didn't Using in an Arbor Day school. Let me lean toward other rails to jump to. Kathleen, uh, do you have anything you want to say to me? Uh, no. Nope. Re wow, really? Not at all. <laughs> But I'm responsible for your career, really. Yeah, no, uh, I got nothing to say. Um, I like Steven more than you, that's what oh. I have to say. <laughs> Steven made my career, not you. Wow, fine, all right, cool. I'll just leave you in charge of uh, the greatest uh, franchise this side of the Mississippi, and this is how you're paying you. Uh, Kimberly says, could either of you explain what Star Wars is for someone who doesn't know? Um, the original Star Wars trilogy well, how about, is about I, uh, a young I, incestuous I don't think boy you, discovering I, his importance wow, in the okay. uh, grand, hmm. <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> grand fabric of the universe. Yeah, let's let, let's let, let's let this imposter tell you all about all about my crea creation, my vision. Okay, George, how would you describe it? I, well, I would describe it as it's a it's a tale of the wills, you know, uh, and and the wills, the wills are kind of um, what exists in all of us. Well, well, no, no, no. I, not necessarily. Uh, most of the time, yeah, but not always. Uh, the will, the wills, uh, uh, kind of exist in, inside of each, each and every one of us, and and uh, the wills are kind of uh, what what push and pull the, the universe in a different direction. And uh, th there are the guardians of the wills, as as uh, as you may as you may see if you dig deeper uh, into into the lore. And the Guardians of the Wells, uh, they, they, uh, well, they, 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 they kind of are the ones that are fostering uh, religion, right? Mm -hmm. And 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 what is the world without religion? Uh, probably uh, better. It's it's a it's a belief system, and uh, and and there is kind of a commentary on that, you know, uh, you know, there's. Uh, there's a good and bad side to uh, to all things, as, as I like to say. Uh, George, uh, can I, so, may I ask a question? Yeah. Okay. I'm so, already answering uh, in, someone else's question, but okay. in my in my time uh, working on We're Back a Dinosaur Story. Yeah. Um, so you're probably your greatest work. Uh, maybe. Uh, <laughs> Jurassic Park, get out of the way. We're Back a Dinosaur Story is where it's at. Yeah. Listen, uh, so listen, in my time working on that film, I, I sort of discovered uh, the beauty and simplicity where you don't necessarily need to explain everything in a movie for it to well, be. Well, I, I got asked. I, um, okay, I got why, asked a question, though, Kathleen. Why did you decide to explain how the force works in the prequels? I got asked a question, Kathleen, and I think that maybe if you listened to the answer, you could have made a better Star Wars movie. <laughs> hmm. uh, and now, uh, back, back to who? I'm sorry, who asked this question originally? Explain Star Wars. No, explain that? Star Wars. Uh, no, when was that? Uh, Actually, Super that? Epic Toad Bros has a much more concise answer. Kimberly, there are stars and there are wars. Oh wow! Yeah, really boil it down. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Well, if if you'd like to know more, uh, the the wills go into what what we commonly refer to as the force. And the force uh, kind of well, it flows between in, in between all of us. The will, the wills, and the force, they are uh, they, they flow between all of us. Um, and and if you uh, are are force sensitive, which means you you can uh, kind of understand and and use the force um, in cool like I don't know sometimes telekinetic ways. Sometimes it's like uh, oh I I knew what you were gonna do kind of way. Um, I, that that is measured through what's called midi and, and midi are are an important part 
uh, integral part of, of, of the entire Star Wars set. Uh, mid you know, you got to measure the midichlorians inside of inside of yourself inside of others. Mm -hmm. And if you if you if you count your midichlorians and and they're less than uh, two point five knots, then you might have a problem. Uh, if if you count your midichlorians and there's like a lump in there, you definitely got a problem. You should probably see a doctor. But uh, once you've figured out if you have midichlorians or not, and and how many midichlorians uh, you have running Wait, in you. Oh, if, you're still George Lucas. Um, if, I'm. Uh... Uh, keep playing. I'll be back in just a little, little bit. So keep playing. Yeah. Okay. Uh, nice, nice to talk to you too, Tennis. Um, where was I? I was rudely interrupted. You were talking about midichlorians for like ten minutes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, so if you if you if you find out how many midichlorians you have, uh, you you may be force sensitive enough to be a Jedi, uh, which which is like a a, a peacekeeper, a guardian of peace. And Jedi, uh, they travel through throughout the galaxy. And they and they protect the innocent and uh, and the ways of the universe. Kind of like I, I wish I had a Jedi to protect me when nice I made that you, deal with the devil, uh, which is my nickname for Kennedy here. But Star Wars, uh, it's about the hubris of the Jedi and 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 how uh, systems are are built to built to fall. Yes, uh, You know, e e even the once great America. Oh, look at that! Uh, how democracy dies with uh, thunderous applause. Once I'm done with you, you'll be thrown in the junkyard. You will feel my wrath. Sorry, George. One moment. I'm just, uh, I'm just explaining the ridiculous backstory of Terry McGinnis. <laughs> well, I, th I, th I think I gotta go. I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm a, I'm a very busy man. I have to rewrite all of Star Wars because, uh... Yeah, also your nurse is coming for you. What? Uh, oh, I don't know. Uh, uh, uh! I can't believe George Lucas was on the show tonight. I can't. <laughs> Guys, a <are> hand. <laughs> I don't know why I went this route. I hate this boss. So poor. I've watched you fight this boss so many times. <laughs> well, yeah, there's only three different final bosses in this game, so. Well, that explains it. I feel like most of them are this guy, but, like, on this level in particular, is kind of annoying. I really should have just let him get the robots. I don't know why he do that. So now that that's done, I just want to say. Yeah, I actually really up? like Solo. <laughs> It's pretty good. Um, I really I, good. I've come, I've come mostly around on Solo. I, um, I didn't love it when I first saw it because it's kind of like, in broad strokes, it's really annoying because it's just sort of like what's every single like passing comment Han Solo has ever made that happens in like a day. I uh, kind of like that for him. <laughs> yeah, it's not my favorite thing, but it's kind of a fun movie. So I, you know what, I'd prefer all of it to happen to Han Solo in like a day over them needing to make like six Han Solo movies. Yeah, that's fair. I, I didn't think we really needed them, <laughs> but you know. I had fun with it. And yeah, it's, it's I, not bad. Yeah. That's 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 what I liked. It was the first time I felt like I was actually watching a Star Wars movie since Disney bought it. Wow, really? Um. Well, okay. So, Episode Seven was fun, but obviously it was just sort of like, uh, let's just sort of uh, copy paste Episode Four. Yeah. With some minor changes. I actually did like that one though. That one was fun. Um. I had big problems with uh, episode eight and episode nine, I was expecting absolutely nothing from. So I just kind of let it wash over me and had a surprisingly good time, even though it's like a very bad movie. Yeah. <laughs> and right one, but I also just kind took of agree that it's really seriously. <laughs> yeah. It's like, I get why people like this, but this doesn't feel like Star Wars to me. And it should have been a show and not a movie. <laughs> Well, that's, I think that's why Andor works so well. Probably. I, I never watched any of Andor. I got burnt out on Star Wars uh, like a while ago. Which Andor is, why I is didn't good. I know they're making a thing taking place Sorry, in a totally Doctor, different era. Is Andor is good outside of Star Wars. Okay. Like, Andor is just good in general. 
I, I might take a peek at it. I just, um, there's certain things where it's like, if it starts taking itself too seriously, it loses me. <laughs> like George Lucas? Like, like, uh, yeah, like George Lucas. I didn't realize how, like, sexist he was. That was, that was kind of weird. <laughs> yeah, honestly, I'm not surprised. It's, well, what was really shocking to me was that, like, every Star Wars YouTuber that, like, just randomly spams, like, totally bullshit rumors was actually, like, 100% accurate. That was what was crazy to me. Yeah. Well, George Lucas just confirmed he's coming back and he's redoing all the sequels. Is he? That's what he oh. just confirmed on the show. Oh, yeah, 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 of course. You're so right. You're so right. That must have happened while I was like, I, sure. I, just, I just left while he and Kathleen Kennedy were talking. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> Goodbye. Uh, I'm more interested in all those holidays and specials. <laughs> yeah, those would be interesting. The bit ended. I'm um, relieved. I was so confused. <laughs> Hang on. I'm still. Uh, I'm still explaining. To my husband. <laughs> Are you doing it through text? He's not here. Oh, okay. Hang on. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Should I, I do my Duolingo on stream? Oh, yeah, do you, should we both do Duolingo on stream? <laughs> uh, I swear we already got this ending. Well, yeah, I mean, guys, I we've definitely done more than 10 endings of this game on this channel. We've done a lot of this game, guys. We're gonna get the same ending a lot, but like pathways are gonna be different. Good times, good times. Guys, we got five bonus XP, I guess. What's uh what's that lady's name again? Uh, is it Amanda Waller? Is that a person? Yes. Okay. Yes. Or I'm sorry, no, Canada is big. <laughs> no, I'm Canadian. Okay. Is Brazil I'm small? I'll just do American. Meine Tochter liebt deine Tochter. Mein Partner hat eine Tante. This is the kind of content people are after. I'm so sorry. Mein Opa liebt meinen Bruder. Oh, let me not stream on time. Oh, let me be George Lucas for a half hour on stream. <laughs> Nobody asked you to do that. That's what I mean. <laughs> my Oma hat eine Schnecke und einen Hund. That translates to my grandma has a snail and a dog. <laughs> Sie liebt meine Freundin. Guys, I got a 120 day streak. Er liebt <laughs> deinen Bruder. So I was thinking after we get the Jetsu movie done we can have a crossover with the Flintstones I think John Good no 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 we're that's over that kind of points. also oh, I'm doing Duolingo hang on Dennis <laughs> <laughs> oh no I missed my opportunity for my pitch yeah yeah oh, George Lucas that's how you need to leave okay. Alexia this is Waking Up by Julian K it's German. I know. <laughs> it's a SpongeBob. For <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's my streak? 379. Hey. hey. That's a lot. It is a lot. But I phone it in most days. <laughs> yeah, me too. How are you guys going to come to Japan? You don't think you're doing with this? Oh my god, you're right. 
I gotta start uh, making time for Japanese. Like, I gotta, I got a textbook and everything. あ、大丈夫。私にも喋れるから。ちょっと教えることができるよ。わかります。そうだね。わたしのプーツですか。Are these my shoes? Um I remember um one time on when I was streaming back in the old days when I used to stream. Um uh it's been so long. Um, I had somebody say like, "Hey, Dennis, you should do a whole stream in Japanese." I'm like, None of you would understand a single word. <laughs> Dude, my build a bear of knuckles. Yeah. Already stopped working. No. <laughs> really? Why? I don't know. Don't get too many times. I, I don't. I don't think so. I I haven't done it that many times. Maybe Opie's uh, doing it when you're asleep. Maybe. Um, but yeah, I like pressed it literally yesterday and I was like, what happened? <laughs> it's just it's just been like a month of Opie going, hey, this thing talks. Sounds like my dad. <laughs> sounds like my dad. What a, what a voice clip would you put for Sonic if you had to take one from the movie? Uh, Meow. <laughs> Honestly, I was going to say that. <laughs> so... Uh, about the trailer version, not the, um... Yeah, 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 not that stupid not actual the, uh, version. They, they changed it. Um... Yeah, I, I know. Ever. Tails? You don't have the best lines, but... Um... Buttcopter. Only Sonic, Sonic the Hedgehog. Sonic the Hedgehog, come over there! Um... And then for Knuckles, uh, obviously you went with the Owls of Fools to think they could, uh, I... But yeah. I would go with, um... But I trusted you! You were my friend! So you can betray your plushie. <laughs> Wonderful. Dennis, is it true that the way number four in Japanese is close to death? Yes, she is death. I can't really say she by itself. Something that's to it. But the number four is read as she. So, like, the number 44 is very bad. It's, like, unlucky. It's like death, death. <laughs> so. No, don't. She's she who to depose. Uh, that was supposed to be death to all who oppose me, but it turned into she she to all that dispose me. In like the voice of strong bad. She 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 to all that depose me. <laughs> Eighteen. <laughs> when I was a kid, you know, back when the home star updated regularly, um, during lunchtime, everyone would say, "Dennis, do the harm star, Hams, not home star, Hamstar. Hamstar voice," and it's just oh, literally just going. I left my shoes at home, and just that, and it would be like, "Do the harm star." <laughs> say the line, Bart. Yeah, say the line, Bart. <laughs> Two to three. <laughs> <Okay, that'll> be... <laughs> ever play Strong Bad's cool game for attractive people? No, but I always wanted no, to. No, I was all about Pleasant Space. <laughs> my favorite, my favorite thing in the trailer for that game, though. You go, it's strong bad school game for attractive people, but you can play too. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty funny. We got to I... get more hot jobs. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna go to have to jump. <laughs> Istanbul, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know the danger action theme? Today it's alright for tonight. Riding on a Corvette and feeling alright. Let's say it's alright for tonight. How come I didn't end my streams with that? Oh my god. <laughs> Looks like I'm gonna have to jump. <laughs> Wouldn't that be a great way to. 
If this isn't a drunk stream, I wonder what a drunk stream would look like. <laughs> I mean, I could show you, but we're not. I, I have. I have some. I have to go somewhere in like a hour. So. <laughs> what? Where are you going? I, to the bar. Wouldn't you like to? Know? For, for no. drunk. No. Wouldn't you like to know, weather boy? I have better <laughs> alcohol. I love alcohol. that kid. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, do you know that one or no? I love that kid so much. No, I don't wouldn't think you, so. You don't, wouldn't you like vine? the weather boy? Disgusting I don't know if it was a like vine or whatever. But... I think it was a vine, yeah. There was, there, was some, uh, there was some reporter or something asking questions about... So, I, What does he ask the kid? I can't remember. I don't know, because the kid stole the show. So. <laughs> I gotta look it up. <laughs> I'll look it up, I'll look it up. Okay, okay, great. I'll I'll leave you to it then. Yeah. How am I only getting a B? Let's consult the funny. strategy guy. Oh, Dennis, got him. <laughs> I can't be Bab. It wasn't mine. Here's a customer out right. here. What's the best kind of done. fire to buy? I mean, you like to know weather boy. <laughs> <laughs> so good. Where are your parents? <laughs> <laughs> the Doom's Eye instructs you to defeat 35 of the gun forces. To do this, you must defeat every gun soldier as you advance through the stage. If you aren't sure which one is a gun soldier, it's the humans and robots. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> to get an A rank on this mission, try to avoid killing the Black Arms, because at the end, it will affect your score for that mission. At <laughs> because at the end, it will affect your score for that mission at the end. <laughs> Great. At the end, Yeah. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Alright, yeah. Well. Um, I saw the funniest uh, uh, tweet this morning. And uh, I, I saved it to my my memory just so I could share it with you, Vinny. Okay. Um. Basically, it had a it had a uh, some Snyder Superman fan or whatever. Um. And it just said like, people who hate Zack Snyder thinks he can't speak Chinese, but here's him speaking c uh, perfect Mandarin. Uh. When when promoting Batman v Superman, and it's got like a picture of him with like Chinese subtitles underneath them, and then all the comments were just like, nobody. Hated Zack Snyder for being unable to speak Chinese. <laughs> that was why I hated him, though. <laughs> well, well, I got some news for you. He can. <laughs> well, thank oh. God. I was really worried. I was cracking up. Quindrew uh, rocks hard. Says, "Hey guys, what's up? Sorry I showed up late, but I was just playing some Cobra Kai too, and the controls on that game were kind of janky. It's fine. You didn't miss anything. <laughs> no, I really didn't. Well, you missed Black Doom earlier. That was kind of that was yeah, kind of cool." He left as soon. Yeah. He's busy, though. Hmm. He's like the dad in those like '90s comedies who would always be focused on work instead of his kid's soccer game, you know? Yeah. Yeah. He was a uh, yeah. He was he was kind of weird. I don't know. He was kind of saying some like inappropriate thing about women. There was a lot of guests that were kind of really inappropriate about women today. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was inappropriate about the plutonium. Says moments. a lot about the person who runs. <laughs> yeah. What do you mean? Almost like he did, <laughs> he, like you don't want woman characters in the science. Guys. I didn't forget. Oh, Dennis, did you hear? I we did. we have we have a way to uh, to get Vinny to want Amy to be in the movie. What? We just have to get him to start shipping Amy in the shadow again. <laughs> again. Again. <laughs> again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is an important conversation that you missed. Uh, no, no. <laughs> I gotta fill you in. Uh, again? Explain yourself, Vinny. This is the lore that I wanted to stay hidden. <laughs> it's not gonna stay hidden. I'm gonna dredge it up at every opportunity. <laughs> Dennis, when I was when this game was fresh, I was shipping Shad Amy, dude. Huh. Yep. <laughs> uh, indeed. <laughs> And and I drew them kissing once. Oh, <laughs> to be fair, I was a preteen. I never drew Sonic. Sonic uh, had just kissing, buddy. So. I, also, I I 
talked at length about how embarrassing I found this fact because I brought this up because someone asked me the most embarrassing thing that I could tell them on stream. And that was what I chose. And everyone was like, that's very normal. And here you are, telling me that it wasn't normal, Dennis. I can't believe Listen, you. Well, well, if you're I agree. Sonic Hedgehog, if you're as obsessed about Sonic the Hedgehog as I am, and I never did it, but you did it, what does it say Pretty about impressive. you? I don't know. It says that he loves love, Dennis. Yeah, what I don't do you love? love? love. Uh, yeah. Myself? Listen, Dennis, you... Dennis is going to be a black dude to this child. <laughs> He's naming his child black dude. Oh, yeah. so that's the character that you figured out. I don't think that rolls off the tongue in Japanese, <laughs> but sure. Wait, wait, Good night, Rachel. Thanks for hanging out. A little, prob little problematic. <laughs> <laughs> a little child called Black Dude. <laughs> Dude, you've ruined my life with that. I <laughs> I bring that up constantly. <laughs> like, not, How do you think I feel? <laughs> I had the teacher is the one who said it to me. <laughs> no, but like, I would literally just say like, Oh, you know, it's just a Sega property, a little Sega property known as Yakuza, like just something <laughs> like that. <laughs> You've ruined my life. I can't like not say it anymore. <laughs> hey, oh, just what are these black creatures? Sonic. Yeah, come on. It's not cool. Even in 2005, that wasn't cool. You were a role model. I think I missed some. Where'd he go? Okay. I'm pretty sure I missed some. Where could I have missed them, though? With these suits. I made a tweet with Plankton earlier today. <laughs> it had him just going, It's becoming increasingly obvious. I can deny it no longer. I think Sonic Frontier might be my favorite Sonic game. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Nightshade. Dennis. Yeah, Night, Nightshade's over here being really supportive in the comments. <laughs> I mean, sure. <laughs> Drew them kissing. Without he loves protection. love. Baby, don't hurt me. It's not even the lyrics. <laughs> <laughs> he loves love! <laughs> I'm restarting. I don't know what I'm doing. I just want to get all A's. We can get a champ time. Trying to get expert mode? Yeah. You ever gotten it before in your life? Nope. Oh. That's funny, too. That's a fun dentist, dude. Oh! <laughs> a good for you, question mark? I was playing to have fun, not to 100% everything. Yeah, listen, getting all the air is not 100% a shadow. 100% a shadow is a death witch. The best black soldier of all time, Jesus. Oh my god, Penny. Stream? <laughs> they gotta have better names, you're right. I, wonder if there are I like that. Speed runs in this game. Oh my god. Well, you can't. With all the paths, it's impossible. You'd be surprised. <laughs> that would be days long. There are speed runs that are days long. Insane. Yeah. Please don't eat on stream. Whatever. <laughs> it's my stream. You can eat on stream. Yeah. I just wanted my wafer cookies. No. I want cookies. Man, you know what kind of cookies I want? Basically air. What? <laughs> I want those cookies that are, uh, like the little, uh, uh, those sugar cookies, like the, uh, ones that, uh, uh, you know, those sugar ones. Cookies. No, no, not those ones. Stop uh, doing George Lucas! <laughs> what, George Lucas, what's your favorite cookie? <laughs> I, uh, I, uh, 
when Star Wars uh, Episode Two: Attack of the Clones came out. <laughs> they had a had to deal with Pillsbury. Nope, and, nope, uh, nope, nope, nope. We're done. It. <laughs> like I, I have a really stupid story to share. I was talking okay. to busy wife, and um, I said to her, like, we're we're just waiting in the hospital. It was yesterday, right? We're just in the hospital waiting and everything, and and I just go, hey, babe, what's your idea of a of, of a perfect date? And she, no joke, no sense of irony, just went. April 2nd, because that's when our baby's going to be born. And I just went, <laughs> I meant, like, a date. <laughs> wait, wait, why is that so close to the line? Hold on. Uh, the William Shatner thing? <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to I, I'm trying to remember the actual date. I don't know. But April it was so 25th. Close. Yeah. April 25th. It's not too hot and not too cold. All you need is a light jacket. <laughs> But the fact that she said it was like she she doesn't know that line, you know. So yeah, that's that's adorable. It was so funny. Vinny, is it Lofthouse yes. cookies? No, I'm talking about I'm talking about those little Pillsbury like holiday cookies. You know, like you'll have like a little ghost on them for the kind that comes in like a roll that you cut. Well, they're typically like pre-cut. You get them in a little cardboard box. And they've got like a little picture of a ghost on them. And they're like, well, Jen, you missed it by the way. Uh, I mean, you missed it because I didn't send it to you. But my apologies. But, oh, sure. Um, <laughs> um, but um, I was in a I was in a, a restaurant and I went to the bathroom for some reason, for some weird reason. Um, like you know, it was one of those Japanese bathrooms with like the like, little control panel to flush and the day and whatnot. Sure. And, um, Stereotypical Japanese and, go. Yeah, yeah, basically, right? <laughs> and, I basically, I, I filmed it for Vinny where I just go, I'm in the bathroom, and sometimes you just need, your toilet just needs a little Lando, and there's just a little Lando sticker of Lando from Star Wars. Lando Calrissian? Yes. Yeah, How you doing, you your parent? <laughs> <laughs> but just, just this, this little Lando. Um, in, the, in the corner of the little control panel, and I was like, I have to send this to Vinny. <laughs> What did I say did in response to that? Because I was pretty proud of whatever I said. A little Lando. You said it's Lindo Calpisi. I'm so funny. <laughs> Jen, you said something? No, oh, I, I don't remember. <laughs> uh, <Lando laughs> I got distracted by cookies again. <laughs> Uh, uh, Jen, I have a question. I've heard these things called rainbow cookies. Have you ever thought about making them or would be interested in making them? That depends on what they are. If it's a cookie where it's like the dough is all the colors of the rainbow, um, that sounds kind of fun to make, but I can tell you right now it's going to turn your poop a really weird shade of green. <laughs> like the Sonic Curry. I've made rainbow cake. I know what happens. <laughs> Some people like that. A weird poop? Yeah, sometimes it's just like, hey, look at that. Yeah, sometimes oh, look at that! A weird, One of know, them orca whales. It's, it's fine as long as you can know why it's weird. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know why it's weird, it's very startling. Oh, look at that. <laughs> look at that! Oh, by the way, you know how, um... You know how Sonic fans have the bad reputation of, like, complaining about, like, the smallest design things and whatnot and everything? Yeah. I, th I think uh, I think Godzilla fans, um, over the new uh, Godzilla and Kong movie, I think they very much um, have have proven that it's not a Sonic thing; it's just annoying people thing. <laughs> yeah, it's just a fan thing. But Sonic fans, I feel like, just get a bad rep with everything because yeah, punch and bad. We're an easy target. I don't like. I drew fan art of Sonic and Power of Shadow and Amy kissing. <laughs> what if that was extra lore? Was I also drew Sonic and Shadow kissing? Yeah, that's the true deep lore. Yeah, I mean that's okay too. You can ship that too. Listen, okay. it's not it's not too late, Vinny. <laughs> what for me to draw that? Yeah. It's not too late. It's never too late. It's never too late. You guys think George Lucas was really like? so dismissive of my Jefferson's idea, he just didn't seem so into it. Yeah, I can't, he, I can't believe I, it, I'd love to watch it. I think George, movie. George has changed. I mean, let's be real. He's kind of not who I thought he was going to be. Alright. It's a shame, you know. Never meet yeah. your heroes, I guess. 
Yeah, I don't know. Oh, well, I mean, like, for, like, maybe the, like, 30 or 40 YouTube channels that are really, like, pressing his, uh, this, like, weird, like, anti-women agenda. Like, yeah. I guess they were probably really excited about that, but, like... <laughs> I can't believe you said, like, women don't watch movies. That's just, yeah. Yeah. Did I... Did I tell you guys about the movie that George Lucas made for girls? Uh... He made a movie. Called Star this, is a, this is a true story. He made a movie, and apparently, what he explained with it is like, well, Star Wars was like for boys, and it's the movie that I wanted to make for girls. And it's oh awful. no, it was. It's so what I said bad. was real. All my stupid bit was real. Your stupid bit was kind of real, yeah. Oh no. Yeah, because uh, no. uh, KN told me about it. <laughs> we watched it together. I was like, this is awful. <laughs> what movie? And she was like, I know, right? Uh, oh, crap. What is it? Hold on. It's, it's bad. It's, uh, me... Sorry, I was up getting water. Let me plug my computer back in. Okay. Uh, it was. It? <laughs> it. Hold on. It. Who was, who was in there? It has its moments. Why? What are you yelling about? Just put it down and get up here. Put the cookie down! No! It's actually a taco. <laughs> put it down! He walked up, he made the whiniest noises. If your cat was going to a fast food joint, what would be their, like, fast food joint of choice? Can I use my dogs? Yeah. Um... Burger King, because they got those really, I don't know about them, I have them in Japan, they have these really, 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 really big burgers that are ridiculously large, and my dogs have no self-control. Did I leave one of those guys alive? I did. You're not talking about strange magic, right? I think it is strange magic, yeah. Yeah, it was strange the magic. I the weird movie it. I was just talking about? That's for girls? Yeah, that was... Well, it's a movie was, for girls, because there's well, I brought it up. It. I, I personally brought it up to Kathleen Kennedy. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. I don't remember. Because well, I, I was like, I was like, I know Lucasfilm made some weird, like, animated movie, and that was... I, I had to Google it. Yeah, it's Chat that. could probably tell when I Googled it. It's that, <laughs> and it's not good. Like, in any way. It's really not good. And also, it's a jukebox musical. Wonderful. Like Joker 2! Oh, yeah. Anybody I was interested when I heard the concept that Joker 2 was going to be musical, and then when I saw jukebox mus musical today, I was like, that's not great. Uh, but they could do something really funny. Perfect. I'm just saying, you could easily do it. Can't read my, can't read my, can't read my Joker face. You, you, you got a prime opportunity to fix this. I um, hope they do it. They should do that. And bad romance? Between Harley Quinn and Joker? Hey, what, what were we talking about while I was struggling to remember the movie? Fast food uh, for cat? Yeah. Little man, what fast food restaurant would you like? He's just doing his weird little dance on a blanket right oh, now. Look, <laughs> He's not telling me anything. Um, I feel like they would like uh, the the fish sandwich at McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> They're Catholics, you see. <laughs> and sweet says Arby's. Bye, Simply Sweet. Thanks for hanging out. Hit the amateur art gal, what is a jukebox musical? A jukebox musical is, uh, it's like a musical, but instead of original songs, it's all, um, like, pop music stuff. The Black Doom jump scare on. just made me fly off the edge. And then on the edge of tomorrow. Oh, I don't have to kill this guy. So hold on, what mission do I need to do here? I've got to Remember get your to heart the tells you to destroy the defenses. Aww. I've got to get to the Ark. I guess I just gotta get to the Ark. 
Oh, oh, oh like trolls. I don't. I did not see trolls, but probably sure that sounds is. right. I said troll. <laughs> I said that just like a minute ago. Oh, I'm shut. I'm looking at my cat doing a weird dance, Dennis. I'm sorry. <laughs> I got it. Vinny goes to uh, um, George Lucas feel for 30 minutes and everyone loves it. <laughs> it no, I think chat truly it. hated it. <laughs> hated it so I think much. chat was very upset that that was happening. Why? I don't know. Whenever I do anything that's not Sonic, people get mad at me. Yeah, oh, me apparently too. a large quantity of your viewers don't care about Star Wars. <laughs> they don't care about anything else. It's pretty Wait. funny. Can I just say... Whenever I tried to introduce J-pop to my stream, just for fun, because I liked it, um, I would have people make comments, and then even on my final stream, my final stream, people were like, oh, J-pop section? <laughs> Guess I can take a nap. And I'm like, yo, <laughs> you know, <laughs> I love Sonic more than anything, but I have other interests. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why I'm not streaming anymore. That's <laughs> the reason. Go. It's hard there to be go. a variety channel. I wasn't even a variety channel, I was just doing what I wanted to. <laughs> That's like a variety channel, a little, kinda. The variety is what I like. <laughs> it's not Sonic, it's variety. <laughs> so why do you do a deep, like, I don't even know if it's a decent draw but it's an A draw why, why do you do a decent draw <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Was it decent? It was decent enough. <laughs> uh, more money, please. Okay, so, um, Jetson's fan cast. Go. <laughs> oh. I gotta be honest, uh, I'm much more of a Flintstones fan, so. <laughs> I can't believe this! Jo George Jetson, Pedro Pascal. Mm -hmm. uh, so Pedro Pascal? <laughs> we need to. We need to only. He's every dad. People, people are tired of. <laughs> yeah, Rosie, Rosie O'Donnell, Anna uh, Taylor Joy as uh, Jane's wife. Yes. Yeah. Jane, his wife. That's exactly why I said it like that. I know. I know. <laughs> Thank you. I had to Thank do you. it in a little song. You did it great. <laughs> in, in a little Garfield. In a little Garfield. What what are his kids' names? Uh, Judy Bam -Bam. and Elroy. Elroy. Did you say Ant Man? <laughs> I said Bam Bam, but Ant Man oh, does tie it into kid. earlier. <laughs> Ant Man, his son. Yeah, I know Bam Bam is Barty's George kid. Is a, George is a big fan of Marvel movies. I love I love Ant Man. I love Ant Man so much. My Ant son's Ant name's gonna be Ant Man. <laughs> Ant Man and the Wasp was my favorite movie. Oh, George Jetson. <laughs> George. I, I'm a good George. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm a good George. This is where it all began. Uh, um, just, just a question. Does George Lucas, like, has he reflected any of these views, or was that just Vinny putting no. something on? I, okay. I was being what every, because, like, there's so many, like, clickbait Star Wars YouTubers that are, like, George Lucas is coming back and erasing the sequels. It's, like, stuff that's, like, clearly not actually happening. <laughs> so I was just saying things that they would probably say on one of their YouTube videos. They would, that was they the would love that. They would love it if that was real. That was the joke. <laughs> no, George Lucas has been like, uh, I wouldn't have done what they did with the sequels. And that's pretty much all he's said about the sequels. That is, it's it's such a good way to do that, too. Yeah. <laughs> it's the correct way to handle that. Yeah, and then the YouTube channels that I'm talking about take that and are like, George Lucas Dude, completely it? destroys Kathleen Kennedy. <laughs> oh, it's like, it's like, it's like the same kind of thing. Uh, the director, I'm sorry, back to Godzilla. The director of Godzilla X Connie was like, yeah, I got ideas for other sequels too. And they're like, he's gonna make a sequel. And I'm like, I don't think he said that. <laughs> you know, like, Kiss I, Brown, I think he for five window. I played Puyo Puyo Tetris 2 on Nintendo Switch. And I played as Sonic. Is that a thing? Yes. And he's yes. got really good voice work. And, <laughs> shut up. Um, and uh, he even goes, if you get a good comment, Whoa. he goes, talk about... He goes, talk about mean beans. So, wow, really? Yeah, I'm, I'm dead serious. That's pretty cool. Talk about your mean beans. No beans or beans. I'm beans. From even Stevens. I like beans better. I like beans <laughs> better. <laughs> what you see is what you get. 
just a bean who loves bean. I'm Sonic the Bean Bean. <laughs> I'm Beans the Bean. <laughs> and then the camera cuts to Shadow, and it cuts back to Sonic, and he's no longer Sonic, but he's a bean. <laughs> <laughs> when Rise of Skywalker came out, to bring it back to Star Wars, uh, one of my friends and I kept on like walking into the room and being like, "You don't just, <laughs> you don't just have power. You have his power." And being like, <laughs> instead of "You're a Palpatine Ray," we would just like fill in the blank with something that sounded close enough to Palpatine. And the one that we kept going on for the longest time was, "You're a Mexican jumping bean Ray." <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, I'm blowing stuff up now. Proud of you. Thanks. I like that Black Doom just spends every level he's in, like, over-explaining every single thing around you. He hasn't been to Earth in a while, but to him, he feels like you need to know what he doesn't know, you know? <laughs> so. Of course he over-explains things, he's your dad. I wish he made more dad jokes. Yeah, that's pretty good. I better add that to my notes. <laughs> Shadow, I see what you're doing here. I see it. It's I. Because I'm doing it. Okay, DLC. Got it covered. <laughs> Someday I'll even work on it. Wow. <laughs> oh, by the way, Vinny. I just want yes. to know there was a whole bit of me getting frozen in the ice in my final stream. Uh, I just need you to know because you kind of started a whole thing of people spamming commands and stuff. You broke it and I wasn't able to do it. No. <laughs> I'm dead serious. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> if it makes you feel any better, I died. <laughs> in real life? Huh? In real life? In real life? Yeah, I did. I died in real life. Goodbye. No, then, 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 final stream. No. Goodbye. So I, I had this whole thing set up. Um, where I was gonna get frozen. George Lucas is I was... my final stream. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna get frozen in ice and fall out when I came back from hiatus, but because you sort of inspired chat to um, spam the commands and everything, it actually broke it and I wasn't able to do it. At what point? <laughs> at what point were you gonna do it? At the end of the stream, so I could be frozen in ice. <laughs> I Don't froze it. it. I I spammed him at the end. I don't remember yeah, doing that. Yeah, in the Sonic segment. I must have. In the Sonic in the Sonic segment. I thought I did that really early on in the Sonic segment. You did, and then you came back for the Sonic segment. <laughs> well, no, I'm <laughs> saying I thought I did it early on in the Sonic segment. Oh yeah, and it broke it. <laughs> oh great. Was it a command? Uh, my thing. Yeah. Yeah, it was a command. Oh. <laughs> and it broke because I spammed commands. Yep, I want you inspired. Hundreds and hundreds of commands to get spammed. <laughs> Just... Wonderful. I'm sorry. Yeah. That's fine. I'm not, I'm not mad. Serious, but I'm not mad. <laughs> well, at least I'm not the guy that killed the vibe at the end. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, who would, who would come into somebody's <laughs> final stream, comment about how they hated a boss, and then not listen uh, to that person <laughs> during their final stream? Just not read the room. Yeah. I still it's I like still love people the who do anything for money, man. <laughs> I still love, I still absolutely love the, the whole, like, I'm blocking every single attack and just control some fine to me. <laughs> <laughs> He's not even here to defend himself. <laughs> Nor do what I want him to, it was stupid. <laughs> Bending control 
Wow. Yeah, Fake I friend. To show up. I asked him to show up and Jen was like, no. Fake friend. Twitter. Kathleen Kennedy would have showed up. I don't... I never... I forget Twitter exists, so I didn't even know you had a stream. <laughs> Alright, man. I would have come if I'd known. I talked about it while well, you were in Vinny's stream. It was Vinny. I was. You were there. <laughs> when was this? My final stream was earlier earlier this month. I don't remember this one. <laughs> oh, very much did. <laughs> I'm sorry. Mm. You're gonna help me get the Jetsons movie made, so it's okay. okay. What about me? I was talking to Jack. Yeah, but what about me? Kind of talking, Jen. Hooray! <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry about that. I'm, I'm notorious it's for totally fine. It's forgetting totally fine. things <laughs> are happening. Okay. Yeah, it's totally fine. I just like, I go, if it's on Twitter, I went on, like, but I know we talked about it here. <laughs> I see, okay. it, but it's you know, I can't let you beans. Aww. Your beans are coming to a beans. You don't just have power, you have his power. Your Mexican jumping bean. Every time you say that, um, all I can think of is my power is your power. <laughs> <laughs> What's that from again? It's from X Men Evolution. Oh. Uh, <laughs> 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 I hope they bring that back in X Men 97. My husband and I have been my quoting that power. the entire time we've been together. <laughs> <laughs> Hero mission. Okay, what's the hero mission on this level? Again? Excuse me, this is a Christian stream. Please don't What? This is no. This is a Vinny stream. Name's not Christian. <laughs> the object is to reach the Chaos Emerald in the base. Use the HMMWV to go as far as you can before it runs out of energy. After going through the atomic. The automatic door, the atomic door, the automatic door and entering the large circular room, go to the middle area and use the gun turret to destroy the gun beetles along the exterior. Grab onto the pulley to get to the outer area. Are you After getting air, rouge. Air yeah. You don't need this, dude. Just play through. You got it. You think so? Yeah. Well, I, just wanted, I just wanted to know what the mission was. It's just getting the Chaos Emerald? Hmm. I mean, yeah, I probably do just got it. I don't know. We'll find out. Are the controls unresponsive? Do you want to blame the controls? Yeah, sure. You're doing great, Freddy. This will just take. I want. I want this gun. Did the car despawn? Whatever. I don't need the car. Stay back. The strategy guy was like, use the car. The and I was like, no. You know, you know, it's funny when a game like Shadow Hedgehog and they're like, we need a strategy guy, but like, what strategy can I possibly tell them to use? Come here. <laughs> the car. <laughs> Everyone who can still move, grab him. Don't let him get away. I am the FBI. 
Dan, did you see Godzilla minus one? I didn't. He's an Academy, Academy. He's an Academy Award winner, you know. Just, just like Jared Leto. The just like Jared Leto. I have no idea. <laughs> Everyone's favorite. Is like Eddie Murphy? Well, it's not streaming anywhere, so I can't watch it yet. There are alternative means. I okay. mean, maybe, but I'd have to. And by those I means, I mean getting the. Oh no, I'm not talking about that. I mean getting the special edition minus color minus one minus color DVD set that's releasing in Japan. Uh huh. A Japanese release? Yeah, okay, you're right. <laughs> I'll do it's that. a Japanese region, movie! Region free. Am I going the wrong way? I am, aren't I? Don't you want to watch it minus the color? <laughs> that had a Mr. Krabs kind of vibe to it, the way you just asked that. <laughs> Did you want to watch it minus the color? <laughs> <laughs> $20 for a ticket. Minus color, Mr. Squidward. Minus color. <laughs> <laughs> I, already, I will tell you guys, this would be no surprise. I already bought the special minus one minus color DVD. Great. It hasn't come out yet, but I, I got I pre-ordered it. I can't wait. It's like the same movie, but in black and white. Was it better in black and white? Shadow. No. The black aliens have ruined <laughs> <laughs> that, that that was Woody. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but we're not in black and white, are we? No. I want you to know that even though you love Godzilla, you have to watch the movie in full color. <laughs> oh, it's good. This version isn't in full color. Is it? It cuts to Woody, he's in black and white? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are you Googling for? Uh, I have no idea really what it even is. I just heard the name a bunch of times. You know Godzilla? Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're good. Subtract one. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> it, so wait, is it just like a peaceful Japanese cityscape for two hours and then it's over? Um, I'll give you I'll give you a rundown real quick. It's after World sure. War II. Japan mm -hmm. is at their absolute, like, zero. Like, they're really in a bad shape. Mm -hmm. um, and we follow this kamikaze pilot who deserted his post and he's trying to find his life back in post-war Japan and oh things couldn't possibly get any worse oh no that's a wish about there you go that sounds, that sounds <laughs> right I don't know that really is the movie though I mean I very no, much I, paraphrased I mean, it but <laughs> I mean that all cracks I, I actually really like that it's set post-world war II since obviously oh, that's kind of where the whole kaiju concept came ooh. from it, it's excellent. Though. It is, okay. it is excellent. Like, as a Godzilla fan, I can tell you this is easily the best one, and one that non-Godzilla fans can watch and be yeah. like, "Yeah, this is great." Julie that's, saw it that's what and I've was heard like, "Over and over," was that it was really, really good. I just uh, never get around to anything before. If I could marry a movie, it would probably be this. Oh. But you're already married. Thanks, Shadow. Damn it. Damn it, he got me. <laughs> Was that light? Yes. <laughs> Damn, he got me. You ever see the video that, that cuts out the monologues and just sits, puts them in silence? <laughs> oh. No. So funny. That's so, funny. It'll be like, um, notice these, 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 um, letters anything you think particular about them and then it's just light and, and l sitting in the cafe for like 30 seconds not <laughs> saying a word to each other and then he just goes well obviously you, you set me up because i could tell these are from kira because there's no reason you'd show me them otherwise sit again for 30 seconds and not say anything <laughs> <laughs> that's incredible hold your position Yeah. yeah, go Vinny. 
<laughs> Gotta tune my mouth trumpet. Yeah. What? Jen been watching in, in Gen I'm so sorry. I was I was looking at Reddit. <laughs> she was so <laughs> enthralled by my beautiful rendition I was, of Hell's I, theme. Yeah, I was reflecting on it and going, "Wow." Um. Wow. Well, I saw uh, Lux and Tigers recently. <laughs> 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 uh, I I watched Elvis, <laughs> which I I keep my, watching. Okay, so my my little is, snowman gonna make it rain from my cat day snow. There just wasn't them. enough money, no matter how many snow jobs. <laughs> Listen, oh, the okay. jolly snowman. To welcome, be, be welcome, my boy. <laughs> welcome, my my, welcome my wiggling my boy. boy. My little wiggling boy. <laughs> okay, so to be to be clear, to explain, uh, my husband's gone a lot this month, so I'm watching the stuff that I'm mildly interested in that I don't want to put him through. Where are they, my boy? <laughs> my dear boy? I, my I, my little way, Elvis I, boy? Vinny, I know I DM'd you this, but seriously, every time something bad happens lately, I just hear, like, spooky, <laughs> echoey Elvis music. Oh, no! <laughs> Just we sort of can like, go home. We can yeah, just sort of like this, this echoey, like, oh. <laughs> so spacious, but... <laughs> I'm so glad I watched that movie. Uh... Um, there was something else. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, in, in general, I just haven't been watching a lot of stuff. Uh, some of the stuff that I've tried to watch, I've ended up turning off just because I didn't think it was that good. Honestly, the last few days, I've just been watching videos of people building terrariums. Alright. It's enchanting. <laughs> if you're happy, I'm happy. Wow. When did Shadow get Batman's car from the Nolan trilogy? <laughs> When the strategy got put in it. Does it come in black? <laughs> <laughs> I've seen a lot of people hating on the Christopher uh, Christopher Nolan Batman suit lately. Is that a general consensus from Bat fans, Vinny? Vinny, you're being asked Batman questions. You gotta uh, talk about Batman. Yeah, I tried to sure reach make, out to him. I sure to make driving him. backing out of the driveway easier. I hate this. I, I hate it here. I hate it. <laughs> the Doom's Eye jump scare that you get in mission select he mode. He, just pops. he looks so excited that you're here. Wait, don't my question. <laughs> what? No, he just ignored it. Just like you ignored about? my Cheetos comment the other day. <laughs> I get a message from Jen last night that goes, you know, I think I've changed my opinion on Shadow Jalapeno Cheetos. And that's all it says. And, and I, I, I messaged her back and said, this is maybe the most random thing I've ever received from you and that's saying a lot. <laughs> oh no, I didn't want to grind. Listen, I don't have a lot going on in my life. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty funny. I just sit at home all day, I try to watch movies, I get distracted and give up. Just watch The Luck of uh, the Irish on repeat. I literally almost watched it again the other day <laughs> just to put something on. Is I it wanted... that good? No. <laughs> it's iconic. <laughs> it's a great time. Uh, I know, I, I wanted to see, um... Uh, Timothy Amundsen in his crazy makeup play basketball. <laughs> I still don't understand why he looks like that. He's a leprechaun. Why is is the he's a fair Derek? Is Kyle going to look like that someday? No, he's a Seamus McTiernan's a fair Derek. 
which is a bad leprechaun. Oh. Oh. Pretty sure all leprechauns are supposed to be pretty shitty in Irish folklore. Not the good ones. Mm. Not the ones that... Sliced to potatoes too thin! Sure, uh, but not... The no. on Lucky Charms. Gun, Dennis, 100% worth watching if you haven't seen it. I've seen a while ago. This is pretty good. <laughs> I had a great time. Just did a commentary um, on it. Uh, we watched, uh, we watched to hear back a dinosaur story, like, a month ago. <laughs> That's true. And we talked to Joan and Vasquez about it. We did. That is also I heard. I heard. <laughs> you came into my stream to talk about that. <laughs> oh. Sure seems like. I hate when they put, like, so many of, like, the dark-type enemies, but none of the... You know, like, if I wanted to kill an alien right now, I couldn't, because there's just no aliens. You can't kill an alien? They just don't let you kill aliens anymore. Stop that. Things are so woke these days. Yeah, this game's so woke. Just like George Lucas. I mean, Lucas Just like film. George Lucas? George Lucas himself <laughs> believes what I believe. <laughs> Which is dead. I can't blame him if we agree, so. Oh my god. Was that really very helpful there? Just remember, guys, when I'm. Um... When I'm not around anymore because I can't come to the stream, just remember that I asked the Batman question and said, I want answer. Dude, I'll totally miss you! I'll totally miss you! Even now he Dude, doesn't answer I'll totally miss you! Oh, well, Dennis, if it helps, oh, I don't know what the general oh, consensus was, but uh, I thought that his second Batman suit looked pretty tough. I think the second one like, looks better than the first one. They were like, he can move his head now! And it's like, okay, but now he looks on, weird. But he's not wearing hockey pads. Protect the president. Um, I think it's I th fine. I think it's not. It's not my favorite suit, but it's not my least favorite yeah, suit. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I think. Uh, I think the Batman one is really good. And uh, I think, yeah, that that one actually like really grew on me. When I first saw it, I was like, eh, and then I was like, actually, love this. Yeah, I I really like it. And also, uh, Adam West that suit because it's secretly oh the God. most comic accurate. I love it. That's a cosplay I really want to do. Is really? is like a super accurate Adam West. Yeah. Oh my God! You could just go to. Okay, uh, you have to. You have to learn the whole Batusi though. Oh my God! I'd love to. Be a good time. Take up a mer Commencing attack plan B. This will just take three. Ah! This is different Batman suits. Yeah, I mean different costumers and artists have different takes on it. Every movie has a different suit. Yeah. Not my movies. Okay. Everybody just wears every, the same every suit. Every Batman movie. <laughs> Not my Batman movies. Okay. Every everyone in Dennis's movies just wears the same three piece suit. Like Doug. Yeah. Like Doug. Do 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 I really think that uh, Nickelodeon should pick up my uh, my pitch for the Doug Funny Diaries. Oh, thank God! Uh, I'd watch it. Perfect. Yeah. Post-apocalyptic Doug. What else are we gonna do with it? Patty <laughs> <laughs> exactly. mayonnaise is gone. Your Doug is just your Matthew Broderick. <laughs> <laughs> what? No. I don't think so. I Yeah, I don't think so either. Get out of my house. Think of it that way. Get out of my house, Patty Mayonnaise. <laughs> it's like an animated version of... Uh, Get out of my house. <laughs> I guess I'm the son of Tim Allen. <laughs> My son too. is Doug. <laughs> My son's a Matthew Broderick. There has to be a 
Two bullets left. How'd that happen? How did I like waste all the hard. Oh no, this is not great. Nightshade says, I don't know, Jen, Nickelodeon seems to be in a sticky situation right now, I think. I know, I saw the documentary. <laughs> I, uh, right now, like, is, I feel like... <laughs> is there more? I, I don't, I don't know if, like, right now is necessarily the time they need to be in the sticky situation, because I think that, like, most of those people have already been ousted from the yeah, network. Yeah, they, they already <laughs> fired Dan Schneider, like, he doesn't work there anymore. <laughs> like... For a while. Hey, years. Star Killer, welcome to delivery. Welcome back to delivery. Appreciate you. I only said Nickelodeon because I thought that Disney Doug was stupid. <laughs> Got him. Perfect. I mean, like, the sad, the sad side of all of that is, I don't really want to talk about that too much, because yeah. I, I don't want that to be the vibe. Yeah. But, uh, like, the sad reality is, is that is likely ha happening in a lot of places, unfortunately, and there just needs to be better... Oversight? Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Like it, it is it is incredible just how uh like unsupervised it is or you know like just just how easy it is for for that kind that kind of uh industry to be infiltrated by the wrong people. And yeah, it's exactly. horrible. And people and do there that. yes, okay. and there needs to there there just there needs to be a better answer but I don't, I'm not the person to be making that answer. Yeah, I, I don't think it's just Nickelodeon. I think, yeah. um, I think it's if, if there, if there are vulnerable people around, uh, oof, be really, really careful in general. Yeah. So I, yeah. I wouldn't even blame specifically Nickelodeon. Yep, yeah. moving on. Yeah, moving on. Should shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> it's always uh, safe in Shadow the Hedgehog. Is it? Aside from all the guns. Yeah, I've got all A's on all the bosses. Is it every... Is it actually every boss? Wow. Every boss. Um... I don't know. Which one should I do next? Hero. Sonic Heroes, Sonic Heroes. Nightshade, that's okay. It was that's not your fault. It's just it was relevant. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. It's the the whole the whole thing is hard to and talk about. Literally, I did just watch it. Like, I think I finished it maybe an hour before we got on this stream. Oh, really? So, yeah, yeah, I just I, watched it today. I, I went that I don't know. earlier this week. Yeah, Let's check it out. <laughs> Hey, Knuckles. Knock, knock. We gotta kill some aliens. Alien killing time. Well then, time for me to go and kill these aliens. How come that did not... All of that... That whole gun. I drained that whole gun into that man and nothing happened. I'd love to see it. That guy you. was in front of me, Knuckles. Uh, what? Thank you, Dennis. Oh. I love you too, Dennis. <laughs> Whoa, Shadow the Hedgehog? Yeah, it's me. <laughs> I'm great. Are you okay? No. Have, you, have you been smoking? Yeah. I'm trying to be cooler. <laughs> More oh. Is smoking cool anymore? In, uh, sometimes. 
I've also been playing a lot of Metal Gear Solid. Oh. oh unexpected. All right. Who's your favorite character, Shadow? Is so cool. My favorite character is Raiden. <laughs> I guess that tracks. I've really come around to him. Did you play Metal Gear Rising Revengeance? Uh, probably. Coolest, coolest titled game of all time? Yeah, definitely. This is a subject I know a lot about. Hey, you dug your own grave, you brought it up. I know. <laughs> this was a mistake. Uh, my good friend Jen's husband was playing a lot of it, and he won't shut up about it, so... <laughs> then, then you should probably know a lot about it if you won't shut up about it. You would be surprised. <laughs> <laughs> you think Jen doesn't pay attention to what you say on stream? <laughs> like, no, what was that thing about the uh, Cheetos? Uh, the Cheetos? Yeah. <laughs> Metal Gear Rising Revengeance, though? Pretty fun game. I, I, I only know numbered ones. <laughs> <laughs> that might be one of the only not numbered ones. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I was like, oh, is there one that doesn't have that? Um, I played Metal Gear Solid 1 for five minutes, uh, like 15 five years ago. <laughs> Actually, wait, yeah, was it? Like, it was like 15 years ago, yeah. Uh, my my husband was like, if you haven't played Metal Gear Solid, you gotta do this. So I'd go and visit him, and he'd be like, time to play Metal Gear Solid. And then he handed me a controller, and I struggled with it for five minutes. And then I said, how about you play it? And I want it. <laughs> and I remember it being very good, but uh, my brain's bad, and I remember almost none of it anymore. <laughs> Basically, Solid Snake goes to an island, and he mm -hmm. says, could you stop it with the big weapons? And they went, no, I'm going to fight you if you don't you know, listen to me. And they said no, and then they fight, and then he stops the big weapon. Cool. Yeah, I'm, I'm needing to, I need to at least replay the first one. Whoa, because look at this. I'm, I'm I'm running I'm running a little How'd that happen? What is happening? What is that? <laughs> Kill the guy glitch. sideways, I guess. Did I don't know, that was weird. Yeah. Um, oh. Never. Yeah, I bet some speed some speedrunners would beg to differ. <laughs> no, I've never seen a Sonic game with a glitch. I've never seen a Sonic game have have a speedrun. I've never seen a Sonic game. <laughs> Jen actually well, well, like, I five never. years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I, I told you before. I told you my biggest shock when being invited to be Jet on Sonic Song was like, "Wow, I'm gonna be with people who love Sonic," and then you find out like two of them like Sonic. No <laughs> surprise. <laughs> be playing Shadow the Hedgehog and having to be like the guy that helps control the lore is pretty funny. <laughs> yeah, but I was under this weird like risk. Like, if you do Sonic, then you must love Sonic. No. <laughs> I think that was more so the case like pretty early on, I feel like more. Yeah, more I was, of the I was cast just members. gonna say as as far as I know, that was sort of the thing early on, but I know that that's sort of gone by the wayside just a little bit. Well I was there. Yeah. I think you could Oh. I go actually there as well. For some oh. reason I thought that you came super early too. No. No. You sold Dude, 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 dude. Well, when was the first year you did Sonic Song? Person. I, just I don't know the exact year, but I I came later. I said, Kayan, can I join? And she said, sure, we have a spot for you. Not! And then she laughed at me. Wow, that sounds just like her. <laughs> right? I know. Sure does. She's really incensed. <laughs> so mean, right? I just wanted to Your contribute. <laughs> I have never played a Fire Emblem game, Chance. Would you like to? I, I played some of um, uh, Three Houses, and... Um, Was there three? How many houses were there? there <laughs> I think there were three. I got... I played it for about an hour, and uh, I realized I couldn't get past how much I hated the main female character design, so I stopped playing it. Oof. 
I respect you. Yeah. I hate that divine too, actually. Untali Snowman says, Jen playing Metal Gear Solid, five minutes should be plenty. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I legitimately tried. Like, I, he was like, you're gonna need to sneak over there. And I was like, eh, eh. <laughs> just like snakes doing all this stupid stuff. I could not figure out the controller for that thing. I, I don't even remember what I was playing it on, but uh, I, I actually did watch it and I actually did love it. It's just been a long time. But the way you describe that, I imagine you have SpongeBob trying to drive where he's like, back it up, backing up, and he like <laughs> floors it. <laughs> it's like, you gotta sneak over there. Sneaking in, sneaking in. <laughs> just... That's basically right. <laughs> well, the pathway we got today was titled, This is Just the Beginning. Was it? Yep. This is just the beginning. Floor it, yeah. floor it. <laughs> backing up backing up backing up <laughs> um okay i think that's all the time i've got unfortunately guys i'm sorry oh Vinny, i love you i love you too i wish we could just uh hang out forever we've only just begun dennis except come through it's over i can't damn it responsibilities it appears the game is over before it even begins <laughs> That's uh, Deathstroke in Batman Arkham Origins. Mm. Wait, Vinny, before we go, I have a question uh, for you. You heard about yep. the uh, the uh, Suicide Squad <laughs> anime? I'm out of here. I don't care. Anymore. What? what no! uh, yeah, the Suicide Squad no. Isekai. I I I heard about it, but I don't. Oh, well, I don't know anything about it. Mm. I just I don't care about the Suicide Squad. As much as DC thinks I, I Yeah, I don't either. I don't know why they <laughs> keep shoving it down everyone's throats. Is it but... basically the DC equivalent of Disney villains? But worse. Because <laughs> <laughs> like, less they... people care. Well, because like the other thing about it is is that like the Suicide Squad is like a rotating team, right? Uh, and it's always like the shitty villains. Like it's never like people you care about. So it's not, it's not like oh I get to see like Scar, or Captain Hook, or Ursula. It's like uh, Captain Boomerang if you're lucky. <laughs> get Ten Eyed Man. Sad. Crazy Quilt. I don't know. Calendar I just feel like. Man. I feel like DC really thinks I like the Suicide Squad, and I, I, I don't. Tobias <laughs> Whale. Is he a whale? He's just kind of a big guy. Oh, I wish he... <laughs> it would be cool if he was like a street shark, you know? <laughs> I, I, I think sometimes they make him like a street shark, but that's just King Shark. King Shark's just I was just going to say, shark. there's already a street shark. <laughs> they can be friends. Oh, mm. that's nice. Hey, I they're bringing know. back street sharks. Street sharks I are know. coming back. It's about time. It's, it's about time. 2024, the year of the street <laughs> shark. <laughs> I'm all about that street shark. Last last time I was talking all about the Flintstones. This next time I'm talking all about street sharks. Oh, I can't wait, guys. Tune in next time when Dennis names his child after street sharks. If I even uh, coming next time, I genuinely do not know. Cool. Yeah, this might be the last time Dennis is on for a long, 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 long time. Yeah, unless so. I want to bring my son on. You guys want to meet my son? Yeah. <laughs> Say something, My son, son is a lion. He's just, he's just screaming. <laughs> All right, guys. Say something, son, and he's like, okay, papa. What if he no, goes, no, he's, get he's out of my actually house? Sounds like, he actually sounds like Michael Douglas. Yeah, I was going to say, I forgot he's Michael Douglas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. What about <laughs> Ants, Dad? Have you ever considered ants? When are we gonna watch ants? <laughs> That's I. I actually was gonna bring that up. The ants is a commentary that's gonna be happening on the channel sometime. <laughs> you the <to> ant. <laughs> you the <to> ant. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot that's why it was gonna be on here. Yeah. Christopher Walken's in it, right? I don't know. Uh, Christopher Walken. I'm an, I'm an intimidating ant. Probably. Ants. I like animals. Uh, yeah, he's, he's, they are. Colonel, he's Colonel Cutter. Oh, of course. <laughs> okay, I gotta go.
Yeah. No, <laughs> then we, I plan to keep him there. Damn. Aww. Damn, not here. Um, tune in next week when I don't stream at my normal time again. Um, Wee. hooray. Sorry, guys. Um, but, uh, we'll be back. A dinosaur story in the month of April, for sure. Uh, with some Knuckles content. Bring me Knuckles. As, uh... The Hound from Game of Thrones would say. Uh, you can find Dennis at Tizzy Dennis on Twitch or on Twitter. No, go to Twitter. I won't be on Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> you can find Jen at Time underscore Soup on t Twitch and Twitter. Eh. No. <laughs> Neither of them are really on Twitch anymore. You can find me on Twitch just as frequently as you can find them on Twitch. Um, <laughs> it's true. Uh, thank you guys so much for being here. Anything else you want to say real quick? Everyone say congratulations to Dennis in the chat right now. Congratulations to Dennis in the chat right now. Why did I say that? Because he said. God, you're, yeah. so, you're so annoying. Okay. Uh, can't wait to never have my friend Dennis on the stream ever again, guys. Uh, I'm gone. I'm gone. I'm leaving forever. Gone forever. Love of you my, my life. Batman questions when you have the chance. Gone forever. <laughs> no one will ever ask me Batman questions ever again. I don't know what to do. Um, okay. Um, this has been fun. Thank you all so much for being here. I'ma love ya, I'ma miss ya. Take That's care. That's what he says. I, I say that. <laughs> I do say that. Goodbye. Ah, uh, sounds. You're now watching Vendo. I gotta go fast, catch up, you been slow, you wins low. Smell the burnt rubber on my midsole. Everything you do once, trust, we'll do it tenfold. And now watch the Vindo. Now watch the Vindo. Now watch the Vindo. Vindo. Good riddance.